everyone, welcome to Jewelry Maker. Woo -hoo! How you doing this morning? This gorgeous rainy morning. Rain this morning. <laughs> yeah. What is going on? It's meant to be beautiful, hot, and sunny this week. What's going on? Don't know, maybe it's only where you are. Anyway, hi, I'm Carol. I'm with you for the next four hours, guiding you through the amazingness that is Jewelry Maker. We want to be your one-stop shop for everything Jewelry Maker related. Oh, really? Okay, thank you. We've got Amelia with us, who's just been doing some crazy <laughs> hand signals with us. Yeah. We've got Deb Rudge. Here she is. The talent that is. Hiya. Deb, how you doing? Hello. Oh. Good. Fantastic. She's with us today. She's here. She's made some absolutely incredible pieces of uh, genuine gemstone jewelry today. We're going to see an awesome, awesome demo with Potter clay as well. Have you enjoyed working with the kids that you've got today? Yeah, they've been really good, actually. They're all really different, yeah. aren't they? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, there's some brilliant, brilliant um, uh, kits and some fantastic demos that Deb's going to be showing uh, us today. So that's going to be fantastic. Deal-wise today, we've got a bit of everything. We do. We've got a bit of everything. We've got loads of stunning gemstone bundles. We've got an amazing emerald bundle, which is going to be coming up. This is just going to sell out in the blink of an eye. The most awesome, awesome, awesome deal for emerald. We've got a great deal for lavender amethyst as well. Woo! We're going to see a demo from this incredible kit. Look at this. From this incredible kit, which includes polymer clay and the most beautiful pot of uh, glitter. It is just the most gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous kit. That's going to be coming up a little bit later on. Um, we've got a fantastic deal for findings, an awesome early bird, which I'll show you in a few seconds. We've got a comb deal as well. Uh, a comb deal where you're literally going to be getting these combs as part of the deal for... for <laughs> that one's alive. <laughs> For free. Uh, and you, we've got all of these gorgeous genuine gemstones coming up on today's show. Labradorite as well. There's loads. There's loads and loads and loads. We would like um, you to text in today. I want to hear your texts. I'd love to be able to read your texts. I've left my glasses in my car this morning. I might have to get them on our first little break. Uh, but uh, but yes, um, please do send us your text today. Uh, text number is 60777. Uh, start your text with the word JM Studio. Your name, where you're from, any questions that you have for Deb at all um, with regards to anything jewelry maker related or polymer clay related or anything to do with the kits that she's going to be showing us or any of the demos that she's going to be showing us. Um, and also, we'd like your text, please. Strange food combinations. Not jewelry maker related. Who cares? Uh, strange food combinations. Have you ever eaten something um, uh, by mistake and actually thought, do you know what, that actually tastes really, really good. I'm gonna eat more of that. And from, and, 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 and from then on, it's become part of your staple diet. Mike, do you have any strange food combinations? Yeah, I, I do kind of have certain, it's a bit weird. Because uh, you know you can have like American pancakes. Come and tell us, come and tell us, Mike. Here comes Mike. <laughs> Mike Mike's on camera, see we can't hear you. We can't hear you when you're over there. Okay. Here's Mike, lovely Mike. Hi. Um, Hi. <laughs> you know American pancakes and you often have them with like maple syrup and bacon. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, if you have bacon with maple syrup, it's also nice. Bacon it's and maple a syrup? It's a idea, but it, it's nice. I can imagine that, actually. Yeah. A strange combination, but very nice. Okay. Thanks a lot for that, Mike. Yeah. <laughs> More from Mike later on. Um, <laughs> Deb, any strange food combinations? Well, they don't seem strange when you like them, do they? Okay. Um, but... <laughs> You're going to come up with a really weird one. <laughs> no, no. It, I, I don't think it is. I don't know. I bet loads of people eat it. Go on. It's cheddar cheese yeah. with honey in a sandwich. Ooh. That's going to be like cheese and chutney almost, I bet, mm. isn't it? Yeah. I know people who have cheese and jam together. Oh. I've never heard of that. Cheese and jam. I like peanut butter and marmite, but that's like not a weird, pe peanut butter and marmite, that's not too weird, is it? A lot, a lot of people have peanut butter and marmite. Um, I have had before bacon, uh, a sandwich, uh, bacon, peanut butter and avocado. Very nice, very, oh. very nice. Very nice, very nice indeed. I'm getting a lot of nose in my no. ear. Claire, Director Claire, have you got any crazy food combinations? She doesn't think so. You better. You have what? Brown sauce and butter sandwiches. That just sounds horrible. You need something else in there, don't you? Kim, any strange food combinations, my love? 
Salad cream on chips? No, no, that's not no. strange. That does sound very nice, actually, mm -hmm. doesn't it? Um, so please do text in. Um, the weirder, the better. But it's got to be truthful. It can't be like toadstool and toadstool and crimping plier sandwiches. It, you know, it needs to be something vaguely believable. Uh, we'd love to hear from you today. Uh, now, have we fixed our gremlins? We got gremlins today. Oh, it happens What can every I say? We've I got come. gremlins today. It's, it's one of those things, isn't it? It's every time I come. It's Deb. <laughs> Deb is the jewellery maker gremlin. The web went down one time and yeah. the overhead camera broke when I was yeah. doing something else. And there you go. I'm. I, I tell you what. I'm. I'm. I'm Sorry. noticing a pattern here. Every time Deb appears on the show, <laughs> things go wrong. She's put a jinx on the channel. That's it. So, what are you going to be showing us today? With them? You, you, you're going to be showing us some polymer clay today, aren't you? Yes. Yeah. Ah. It's um, a sneaky little trick. It is a trick, isn't it, this technique that um, yeah. Deb's going to be showing us. It's a cheeky little trick because it's something which um, you've probably all got at home if you've got the, um, the uh, polymer clay starter pack. Um, and I bet you've never used it in the way that Deb's going to show it to you. So, so, so it's going to be a fantastic technique that Deb's going to be showing you a little bit later on in the show. Uh, what should we do? Just keep chatting. I can do that. I can do that. Um, we can't access any text at the minute. Right, okay, so if you want to put on our Facebook page um, um, any strange food combinations, we'd love to hear from you today. Amelia. Oh, sorry? Oh, Amelia, any strange food combinations? I just cook weird. I don't follow recipes, so I get loads of cook options. Example. Any strange food combinations? Come on. Well, I was making chili con carne. Chili con carne, okay. yeah. And I suddenly realised I didn't have any humans, so I just threw in some... Uh, chili con carne and... I put in paprika and... Paprika? Paprika? And turmeric. Turmeric. Yeah, <laughs> Did it taste like a curry then? Curry, yeah. Because turmeric is something which is which you, which you put in curries, Amelia. Uh, that's true. I just called it savoury mince and beans, really. So it's, it that went works. from being chili con carne to just savoury mince and beans. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds delicious. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. Um, now, if you are brand new to jewellery maker today, welcome. Um, we're, uh, I was going to say, we're not always this crazy. Uh, oh, we are. Sorry, sorry. Uh, you're going to have to keep watching. Sorry. Um, so um, if, if, you are, if you are brand new to jewellery maker, you're going to get a number of things um, free with your first order. Can I show you the things you get free with your first order? Would that be okay? Um, the things that you get free with your first order are absolutely incredible. You get things like your free Get Started DVD. This is an hour-long DVD, okay? It's full of hints, tips, tutorials, um, a really, really fantastic DVD with um, um, loads and loads of guidance. If you are brand new to jewellery making, it's fantastic for you because it shows you really basic techniques like how to roll a head pin. Uh, it comes with a voiceover as well as the demos. If you are somebody who is a very seasoned jewellery maker, it's fantastic as well because it might help you refine some of the skills which you've already learnt on your jewellery making journey. Um, so you get your free tutorial DVD. This is free with your first order. Actually, you don't even have to make an order. You don't even have to place an order to get this. You just give us a call on our free phone number um, and, and ask the call centre to send it to you and we'll send it to you, which is fantastic. You also get your Get Started with Jewellery Making booklet, um, which has got loads of information in including information on all of our basic toolkits, wire, elastic, findings. Findings are the kind of uh, mechanics which hold pieces of jewellery together. Lots of information on findings, what they're useful for. Lots of information on our DVDs, our starter packs. There's information there on our silver clay kits. Um, you get that free with your first order. You also get a copy of the JM Hub magazine every single month, which is a monthly mag, which is fantastic. And you also get information on our workshops here at Jewelry Maker as well, because you can come on, uh, come over to our studios in Redditch and uh, come on one of our workshops, and you can learn anything from polymer clay to chainmail to uh, using wire to using silver clay. Um, um, whether you are a beginner or you're really, really advanced or you're a professional jewelry maker, there's something on this channel for absolutely everyone. We want to be your one stop shop for jewelry making. Now, um, there's a bit of information uh, 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 to follow how to get involved, how to buy, how to place that first order with us here at Jewelry Maker. We'll be back in a couple of seconds and hopefully I'll be able to bring you the early bird, which is absolutely stunning. Don't go anywhere. The fastest way to shop with Jewelry Maker is by going to our website. Just click on the sign up button. Once you've filled in the required details, you can start shopping. You can watch the show by clicking the watch live button on the front page. You can also use our refine tool and narrow down your search. 
Once you've found an item that you like, just simply click on the Buy Now button and the item will be added to your basket. Don't forget you can add as many items to your basket per day and still only pay one p and Enjoy shopping with Jewelry Maker. If for any reason you're not satisfied, you have the benefit of our no quibble 30 day money back guarantee. Just complete the returns form enclosed with your goods and send them back for a full refund. We all know having the right tools for the job is important, so we here at Jewelry Maker have designed a toolkit which includes all your essential pliers for jewelry making, including round nose and flat nose pliers, wire cutters, as well as a bead reamer, snips, and tweezers. You've got everything you need for just $9.95. We provide the tools, you provide the skills. Get creative with the Jewelry Maker. You can watch Jewelry Maker live every day from 9 till 1 on Sky 655, Virgin 756, Freesat 807, and now Freeview Channel 30. If you have a question or query for Jewelry Maker, then you can contact our call center on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewelrymaker.com. When you place your first order with us, you will receive a free booklet and DVD full of handy hints, tips and tutorials to help you get started with your new Jewelry Maker hobby. When shopping with Jewelry Maker, you can add as many items to your order in one day and only pay one postage and packaging charge. We have two delivery options. Standard delivery at just £2.95 and you'll receive your parcel within four to six days. Or opt for our premium delivery at just £4.95 and you'll receive your parcel within three to four days. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. If you're new to jewellery making and want to learn all the essential techniques, then this is the perfect workshop for you. Join experienced resident designer Linda and learn how to get to grips with this addictive hobby. Learn how to create necklaces, earrings and bracelets with genuine gemstones. You will also have the opportunity to try a range of jewellery making mediums for beginners including wirework, macrame and kumihimo. The full course includes a wide selection of gemstones and findings, threading materials, 0.4 and 0.8 silver plated wire, use of all relevant tools, a buffet style lunch and refreshments, a tour of the studio and our museum and a visit to our shop. All of this for just £59.95. For more information contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. Start your new hobby today with Jewellery Maker. Jewelry Maker course gift vouchers are now available. You can choose from a bronze, silver or gold voucher. Each voucher is worth a different amount that entitles you to put towards a course of your choice. For more information, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. This Sunday, join us on Jewelry Maker as we celebrate our fourth birthday. We've got a jam-packed show in store featuring many of our guest designers to share their knowledge and skills and we'll be introducing you to some brand new products, new tools, exclusive strands, brand new DVDs and much, much more. So join us this Sunday and help us to celebrate this very special day, Jewelry Maker's fourth birthday. There we go. We're so excited about this Sunday show. It's uh, Jewelry Maker's fourth birthday. That's going to be coming up all day on Sunday. We've got some incredible, incredible, incredible pieces coming up on that um, on that show. We've got um, pretty much all the guest designers in. We've got loads of the presenters in. It's just going to be absolutely fantastic. We're going to be launching the most incredible DVD offer, brand new tools, brand new strands. It's going to be absolutely wonderful. Um, Coming up on today's show, because we've still got gremlins at the minute, I'm ever so sorry, we've got sapphire drops coming up at about midday. We brought you, uh, yesterday, we bought you an incredible strand of ruby, and it was the first time that strand had ever been brought to you on the day show. Um, this strand of sapphire is going to be coming up at about midday today. It is unbelievable. Um, 
dare I say it, going to a similar price that the ruby went to yesterday that sold out in seconds. This incredible strand of genuine sapphire is going to be coming your way at about midday today. Just fantastic. Um, our, our early bird today is absolutely wonderful. It's loads and loads of pendants. Um, I'm not going to call them cabochons because they are drilled, but we've got loads and loads of pendants coming up today. Um, also on the show today, this is going to be coming up. We've got loads and loads and loads coming up today. So we've got the Dremel coming up. Um, we've also got the Wags Wycone, uh, which is going to be uh, back in stock. Um, the Dremel, we've, only, we've got less than 50 of. Uh, the last time it was bought to air, I think almost 50 sold. So, so it's going to be really fantastic to see, um, to see how quickly those will go, hopefully in this hour. We've also got a fantastic deal for gold-plated copper findings packs. Um, it is an absolutely gigantic findings pack. 2,400 findings coming up in the 11 o'clock hour today. Uh, Sapphire coming up at midday as well. Um, loads and loads and loads um, um, coming up on today's show. Now, we give Deb three kits to work with. We give all our guest designers three kits to work with um, in preparation for the show. She's just getting um, some pieces of jewelry out for us to have a look at because there are some absolutely gorgeous pieces that she's made up for today. And you'll be able to see just how um, different each one of these three kits um, um, is. I've shown you this beautiful piece here, which has just got the most gorgeous polymer clay bead on the bottom. Such a stunning, stunning piece. Look at that, isn't that gorgeous? And she's set the translucent clay with this gorgeous glitter quality. Oh, it's just beautiful, isn't it? If you miss anything on today's show, you can always go to our YouTube channel uh, to uh, re-watch shows, to watch them from the beginning again, to kind of go over tutorials again. Here's details for our YouTube channel. Um, it really is absolutely fantastic. Um, and if you want to go to our Facebook uh, page as well, there are over 26,000 people who like our Facebook page as well, which is fantastic. Um, so if you want to go in there and ask what you, uh, what you want to do with, um, what, what you can do with um, certain strands, certain pieces coming up on today's show, you will get loads and loads and loads of advice and loads of comments about what you can do with certain things coming up on today's show. So if you're brand new to Jewelry Maker and you're looking for inspiration, um, then, then always go to our Facebook page, it's fantastic. You can also join us on Twitter as well. We don't talk about Twitter a lot, but go to our Twitter, Twitter account, which is fantastic. So if you want to join us on Twitter, fantastic. Sorry, Kim, you said that we had, a, we had some, um, somebody commenting on our Facebook page. Shirley from Facebook, she likes peanut butter and Marmite, that's good. And cheese and banana, slightly weird. Shirley, that is weird. Cheese and banana. Marmite, marmite, peanut butter and banana. Very nice. Pe yeah, mar yeah, pe yeah, banana and uh, ma banana and peanut butter on toast is very, very nice. One of my daughter's favourites. In fact, she had that for a tea last night. And a and a pot of yogurt. I wasn't interested in the yogurt. Just wanted to chew the pot. Ridiculous, isn't it? Beetroots on burger. Yeah, okay. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. Yeah, very nice. Beetroots on a bacon sandwich, very nice indeed. Do go to our Facebook page and um, uh, let us know your strange food combinations. And hopefully our, um, hopefully our, oh, hang on. I'm attached to the chair. Ho oh, I'm still attached to the chair, there we go. Um, hopefully um, our systems will be up and running in a few seconds and I'll be able to bring you the early bird and oh my goodness me. Look at all these pieces of jewelry. Deb, there is literally every single piece that you've made. There is. Oh my word <laughs> I didn't realize I'd made so much well but before the show before the Joe before the show um Deb had all of these pieces of jewelry just lined along the back she said oh my goodness me I've made so much jewelry and you have <laughs> there is so much jewelry here and actually Mike's and Mike's um, um, um going along the line of jewelry and you can see just how different all these kits are First one's very green, very spring-like. The second one has got all of this gorgeous polymer clay running through it. I'd never have thought of putting translucent polymer clay with them um, with that no. glitter. It's beautiful, though, isn't it? Yeah, it works really well. And then the third kit has got these beautiful pinks and purples in it, and some beautiful moonstone. Look how Deb's used the findings in this necklace here. It's beautiful. The findings packs that we have with our kits are amazing, aren't they? They're really, really gorgeous. Nice. Really pretty. Um, and I, I do love the rose gold. Um, mm, colour. So do I. Um, but the 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 um, where the chain actually connects into the moonstone mm. um, section there, that's the earrings that I've straightened ah. out and used at the bottom of the chain. Yeah. Um, and then the f 
the floral sort of motif is mm. reflected along in the rosary links. Yeah, so. it really is. You see, this is it. When you get a findings pack that um, comes with our kits, you'll get 115 findings in, in, in most of the um, findings packs that we offer you. Um, and the findings that Deb's talking about here at the bottom, these are actually earring findings. You don't have to use earring findings as earring findings. As you can see, Deb has used these earring findings just as a connector. It's a really, really clever way in using findings in just, in just a slightly different way. You don't have to use head pins as head pins. You can uh, make them into little coils and use them as little spacer beads. That's the great thing about um, the findings packs that you get from Jewelry Maker. You're not, you're not limited, are you? No, no. Um, it's malleable enough to, um, to allow you to, to change its use. Mm. Um, and also I break, break the um, connectors down and, mm -hmm. and just then combine them in a different way so it's it changes what you, you're able to make then so it, yeah it absolutely does and, and 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 you'll see with a lot of our guest designers they're starting to use these findings in really weird and wonderful ways like, like Deb's done here and you get such a beautiful looking piece of jewelry can't wait to see these demos today Deb they're going to be gorgeous thanks for that welcome now you've put all this jewelry yeah. out here you can it take all it all back. off again it's ridiculous <laughs> isn't it oh I tell you what it's so frustrating we've got so much to bring you on today's show the early bird is absolutely superb. The finding still, where you're going to be getting two, uh, 2,400 findings, that is just here. That's sitting there waiting to go. And that's going to be coming up on today's show. I want to show you a gemstone bundle that we've got coming up on today's show as well. This is amazing. One of the biggest and definitely one of the most beautiful labradorite, pen, uh, labradorite um, uh, uh, bundles that we've ever bought you coming up on today's show. All of this for one great price. That there, that's a strand of pendants, isn't it? Let's face it. How would you feel if you were able to get each one of these strands for under a tenner each as part of a great deal, as part of one great deal? This is all Labradorite. It's just stunning. I mean, surely this strand here, that strand there, should really... I mean, surely that strand there on its own should be, what, 17, 18 pounds on its own. Do you know what? The whole bundle is going to go to such an amazing price. What time are we going to do this one, Kim? Do you know? Kim says she was thinking about 11, but who knows now because everything's just been thrown out the window, basically. It's difficult. Probably, probably, probably nearer to 12. That's going to be coming up a bit later on in the show. Um, loads and loads and loads coming up on today's show. Please let me remind you as well, we've got this incredible comb deal. Um, where, I don't, I don't know if I should be saying this, where you're going to be getting this incredible deluxe gem selection here. I don't know if you've seen these before, they're absolutely beautiful. Deluxe gem selection. And essentially you are going to be getting all of these combs. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine combs for free for free it's going to be absolutely amazing that's going to be coming up on today's show as well i know that loads of you have been waiting um uh, to get the combs back in stock so that's going to be fantastic as well we've also got um, a toggle plastic a toggle a toggle tastic deal don't say that after you've had a couple of glasses of the wine um for um rose gold plated and for silver uh, toggle class tea bar class as well we've also got the dremel back um, um on the show now we've got less than 50 of the dremel left in stock um it's going to be absolutely superb and pretty much all of these strands here are going to be going to uh, down to prices that you've never seen before this strand of smoky quartz is delicious one of the most beautiful strands of smoky quartz so incredible if i told you this strand of smoky quartz coming up on today's show believe it or not this strand of smoky quartz is going under a tenner yeah I know, it's absolutely amazing. Coated smoky quartz, it's seriously, seriously beautiful. That's going to be coming up on today's show. We've also got the most beautiful strand of fluorite as well. The Wags Y-Cone, the Knotting Tool, the, uh, t the uh, what else have we got? The, uh, the One Step Looper as well. Have a look at these findings. These are gold plated copper findings. 2,400 findings. 2,400 findings. Look at that. Oh! Check that out, Deb. Have you ever seen as many Ooh. spacer beads as that in a box? Treasure. I know, it is, isn't it? <laughs> Treasure. It is, yeah. I'm a magpie. <laughs> um, 2,400 findings coming up as part of a one drop deal. But not yet. <laughs> not yet. All of this chain as well. This is all going to be one great price. 
the incredible early bird as well. I'm so sorry we can't bring you, uh, bring you anything at the minute. It's just so frustrating, I know. IT are on it, apparently. Um, this incredible deal for, they're not cabochons because they've all got drills going, uh, drill holes going through them. A selection of incredible pendants. Now, Rosanna, one of our budding beaders, has made up jewellery out of all of these incredible, um, beautiful pendants. And you, we're going to be doing a deal for all of these. You are just going to love these. Heart-shaped pendants, oval shapes and squares. Stunning, stunning deal for you today. Are we done? Yeah! Are we back <laughs> in business? Yeah! Oh, yeah! Right. There's going to be no talking now. It's just going to be deal after 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 deal. Should we do the early bird? Let's do the early bird. It's not so much the early bird. The kind of midday bird it should be called now, shouldn't it? The early bird, the not so early bird, the kind of just rolled out of bed bird. The can't be bothered bird. The bird that couldn't be bothered to get out of bed bird. Like Naomi Campbell, she didn't get out of bed for anything less than. Ten thousand dollars or something? Yeah. I mean, so what? Get, get a life. Come on, love. Come on, <laughs> love. Let's give me a cup of tea. I'm up. I'm ready. I'm at it. Right. Here we go. So Rosanna, one of our budding beaters, has made up jewellery um, out of these incredible pendants. They've all got drill holes going through the centre of them. You're going to be getting a heart-shaped uh, pendant. This gorgeous kind of tablet-shaped pendant as well, which I absolutely love. I love the wire work that she's done over these. It's gorgeous. The great thing about these is the fact that you are going to be getting a drill hole going through each and every one of these. So they're not cabochons. I'm sure you can understand they're not actually cabochons. Um, they are they are pendants because they've got holes going through the centre of them. Um, setting these with um, uh, head pins, piece of cake. Honestly, a piece of cake. Literally pop a head pin uh, through or pop a piece of wire through and you can make this into a pendant so, so easily bag charms, making them into brooches to put on a scarf, something like that, you know, really, really beautiful, top, top quality genuine gemstones. I think these two squares, which are kind of like a, a banded agate, which have a banded agate quality, I think they look a little bit like tortoiseshell. They look really, really fantastic, don't they? This was some antique bronze wire, maybe. Really stunning quality. Now, the square gemstones that you're going to be getting here are really, really large. They're 40 millimeters across. You can make some really funky buttons out of these as well, couldn't you? I like that idea. Funky buttons. Um, the big uh, oval that you're getting here, 48 by 20 mil. You could, I mean, you could make a massive ring out of one of these, couldn't you? Either going down the finger like that or make kind of like a, a double knuckle duster kind of ring, which are really, really, um, that design's really, really popular at the moment. Loads of you coming through already, which is great to see. I'm so sorry about all the technical issues that we've had this morning already. Hopefully it means that we'll be plain sailing all the way between um, uh, now and the, uh, and the end of the show. Um, Fantastic hearts as well. Three of these gorgeous hearts. Make them into brooches, put them into a, set them into a headband, put them as a centerpiece on a bracelet. The great thing about these gemstones, they'll do a lot of the work for you. They'll make a very, very simple design look really effective because, of course, the gemstone creates pretty much all the interest. So it could be a really, really simple design. Now, okay, you're going to be getting one, two, three, four, five, six genuine gemstones as part of one great deal. We're going to give you a great price on these. Um, purely because it's an early bird special. Your deal for all of these, £8.95p. Fantastic. There you go. Done. Eight ninety five. That's less than a pound each. What a fantastic price. What a fantastic treat for you today. Just absolutely stunning. Isn't that gorgeous? Sorry, uh, sorry just over a pound each. So how much does that work out to each, um, um, for each pendant? About one pound, yeah, about pound fifty. That's incredible. That's absolutely incredible. You've got to think as well, how much, how much is a gemstone like this going to change the look of your jewellery? If, you, if you were to make a really beautiful uh, long necklace, a long elongated rosary style necklace like the one that we saw Deborah made a few seconds ago. Um, so a, a rosary style necklace and it's nice and long and then asymmetrically, just, just on one side, maybe, I don't know, here, you had, I'll put it here because it's a bit easier for the, um, 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 on, on this side, and you, and, and you have an asymmetric set heart with just rosary chain coming out the bottom and out the top. That's gonna make that necklace look even more fantastic, isn't it? 
And is it going to change the kind of price you can sell that jewelry for? Of course it is. Absolutely 100%. Now you are jumping on the phone lines and jumping through on the web to come in and get this. Let me remind you, if you don't already know, you get a 30 day money back guarantee with everything that you get from Jewelry Maker. Not only that, um, you're only paying one lot of P&P for the whole day. That lasts um, for the day show between now and 1 p.m., the designer inspiration show between 1 and 5 p.m., and the late show between 5 and 9 p.m. as well. Just 2 95 whether you come in and get everything here, just these, three kits, 18 bundles, 11 strands of gemstones, you're only paying 2 95 P and P per order. That lasts for the entire day, so you can just keep on shopping. You're not paying any more in P&P, even if your parcel weighs a ton. You're not going to be paying any more in P&P. Um, loads and loads and loads of you come through to get these. As you can see, these are going really, really quickly. The great thing about Jewelry Maker as well, once you're on the phone lines, once you come through to get this, um, it's not just, you are more than entitled to come in and get more than one of these bundles. If you want to get three or four or five of these bundles, you're more than welcome to do that. Um, speak to the call center and say, I'd like three of these bundles, please. So I want to make a matching pair of earrings or a matching set of jewellery, uh, a matching suite of jewellery out of out of uh, two of the hearts in this, then by all means, come in and multi-buy. Um, a lot of people do multi-buy on the phone lines and on the web. That's why a lot of these bundles go very, very quickly indeed. If you want to multi-buy on our website, um, it's just a matter of um, changing the quantity on the uh, website and, um, and, and, it, and it's yours. But do check out your baskets as quickly as you can. We've got a text in, which is great to see. Morning, JM. I would like to put the pendants on a long piece of chain to create a long necklace. Love the show. Thanks, Laura. That, that's a nice idea, making these into a nice long necklace, don't you think, Deb? Yeah, definitely. That's what I'd do with it as well. Mm. Um, with a bit of a tassely thing with chain and... Ooh, nice idea. Actually, just just a long chain yep. with one of these pendants with just yep. a tassel coming out the bottom. That would be yep. such a simple design, but so beautiful. Yeah, they, they work so well because they've got a bit of weight behind exactly. them. Exactly, and, and yes. the size of them. They just work brilliantly. So actually, even if you would set them with just some plaited beading thread, the weight would be enough to kind yes. of pull that down. It wouldn't spring up because of the um, yeah. beading thread. Yeah. Fantastic. And right. some of the colours that we've got in the beading thread. Um, oh, we we'll go beautifully with these. Different colours. Pick out some of the tones within the stone. I like that idea. Mix all the different colours on the uh, the beading thread. That would be nice. Yeah, plaiting different uh, different kind of colours of beading thread to get a nice idea. So um, do get those. I've still got you coming in for those. Um, there's definitely chances still left. We're moving on just purely because of time because because we're literally half an hour late for the um, show today. Ever so sorry. We're going to challenge Deb. Hello. Hi. I'll stand now. Up. Now, 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 now. When I was told the challenge that we were going to give Deb today, and I actually saw what um, we were planning on giving Deb, I, I have to say, looking at this kit, um, and looking at each one of these strands, each one of these strands for me is the kind of strand that we would have on the show and we would sell it on its own. Mm. Um, quite often our new in strands or strands that we, um, or strands that we bring you um, 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 that are, that we sell separately quite often have either an incredible rarity behind them or they look very unusual or they're very large gemstones or very petite gemstones. They've all got something different about them. In this kit, every single one of these strands I would I personally would see as a midday Sunday afternoon strand that is like we've, we've been showing it to you all weekend and saying it's coming up this weekend every single strand here i think has got something special about it mm. i'm very happy <laughs> no, i bet you are i bet you are right <laughs> the first strand i'm going to show you is just delicious i haven't seen anything like this on jewelry maker before what gemstone is this this is absolutely gorgeous feels amazing mm. twisted leaf beads it's obsidian oh this is natural volcanic glass wow natural volcanic glass obsidian twisted leaf beads now i don't know if you can see but can you can you see that go oh yeah there you go perfect thanks for that mike a beautiful shine on this obsidian twisted leaf bead can you see how on each one of these leaf beads you've got that leaf uh, quality you can see the veins of the leaf that have been carved into the gemstone i've never seen anything like this on jewelry maker before quite often you see guest designers who make leaves out of polymer clay or they make leaf designs out of uh, wire and put mesh over the top of them i've never seen gemstones formed and carved in this way i think this is absolutely gorgeous can you see that detail that etched detail on each one of these leaves so you're getting a whole strand 
of obsidian twisted leaf beads and they're big they're 25 by 15 mil stunning really nice to get black leaves as well normally they're blue yeah. gemstones or they're clear gemstones um but they're jet black completely the opposite now clear colorless eye clean pretty much an eye clean strand of clear quartz carved flowers oh this is so beautiful yeah <laughs> oh, these are gorgeous, Deb. These are they this are. is a gift, isn't it? They are absolutely divine. I've, Aren't not, they just? I've not seen that strand before. No, neither have I. Neither have I. Um, we've we in the past we've bought you those carved roses um, of uh, carved rose shaped gemstones, which have been absolutely gorgeous. This is like a proper flower shape with individually defined petals. This is absolutely gorgeous, and I love the fact that they're clear. I love the fact that you can see all that incredible clarity. They look like liquid flowers. They're beautiful, mm. aren't they? An entire strand of these gorgeous clear quartz flowers. So first of all, you've got these two incredible strands, carved leaves and carved flowers. Next strands. If you're gonna get a black strand of gemstones, if you're gonna get a graduated black strand of gemstones, it's gotta be faceted. And this has been faceted. Graduated faceted rounds. Look at that. So graduated um, round gemstones are going to give you gemstones perfect for earrings, necklaces, bracelets, pretty much everything. This is black uh, dyed agate. These are graduated from between 6 and 14 um, size faceted round beads. Um, Deb, I think, I think also having a graduated strand as well. You've got gemstones in here perfect for all sorts of pieces, haven't you? Yeah, yeah. They're really glamorous. And they're individually knotted as well. They are. If you wanted to, you could just add a clasp onto the end of this and, 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 and there's your necklace. In fact, can I pop this onto my neckline? Have a look at this. Just kind of, just it's individually knotted as well, which you don't normally get with um, our gemstone strands. They're lovely. Oh, oh that's gorgeous. Mm. That just on its own, beautiful. You can even put some little crimp covers over the knots if you wanted to. I've got one more strand though. I've got one more strand. Double strands, so the equivalent of two strands here, around about 80 to 90 centimetres of Iolite. Iolite, the most incredible blue gemstone. Um, because of its colour, because of its beautiful organic quality, um, and because of its optical property, something called pleochrism, you have a gemstone here which uh, looks like a lot of other gemstones, so it looks like it can look like tanzanite, it can look like sapphire, it can and does, I think in this case, look like kyanite as well. It's a beautiful strand of eyelight, just absolutely gorgeous um, uh, nuggets. Now, all these strands together, the equivalent of five strands of genuine gemstones. They're all special, aren't they? They're all wonderful. They all on their own. I think, you know, if there was 100 in stock of each one of these on their own, they would all go, wouldn't they? Yeah, 100%. That's not it though, because with this kit, we're also gonna give you a threading pack, monofilament beading thread and elastic. We're also gonna give you 115 silver plated copper findings, which are just incredible. Look at all those findings. You're getting a meter of chain. You're gonna be getting the most beautiful earring findings, which um, we saw Deb use in a really unusual way in the necklace, which we're gonna see um, um, a little bit later on in the show. Look at these earring findings here. This is all silver plated copper. A meter of chain, head pins, crimp beads, crimp bead covers, toggle clasps, and the most gorgeous flower connector as well. Let me show you that flower connector. And I've got another extra to show you as well. Look at this, isn't that beautiful? Isn't that gorgeous? 115 findings as part of this findings pack. Amazing. Now, there's also two extras with this kit. Yeah, there's even more. 10 meters of 0.8 millimeter gauge silver color copper wire. 10 meters. And you know what? There's another 10 for you as well. 20 meters of 0.8 millimeter gauge silver colored copper wire as well as your threading pack as well as 115 findings as well as the equivalent of five strands of genuine gemstones everything here including that incredible findings pack everything here should be 49 pounds 10 p so pretty much 50 pounds yeah everything here should be 49 pounds 10 p do you think it's going to be 49 pounds 10 p 
Now, it's not even going to be £39.10. It's not even going to be £29.10. And Tempe, today, have a look at your price point for this incredible kit, $24.95. This is incredible. Now, Deb, first kit I ever worked with was a black kit. It didn't have any white in it at all. It was just a black kit, black gemstones, black agate, and it was called Black Velvet, and it was about, it was almost four years ago, right at the beginning of Jewelry <laughs> Maker. Um, and what I found, looking back with the kind of benefit of hindsight, I know why that kit was such a great kit to work with as, as, as a brand new jewellery maker. And it's because I wasn't confused by colours, I wasn't necessarily confused mm. by sizes and shapes. Every gemstone went together. I could really concentrate on just, on just doing some really gorgeous techniques. With this, this kit reminds me a lot, reminds me a lot of that first kit because you've got gemstones here which doesn't matter how you put them, they're all going to go together. Yeah. And because you're... Y yes, you're going to get a denim blue, but you're essentially getting black and white. You can really start to focus on the design, can't you? Yeah, yeah, you can. But the thing with that that blue in particular, it, mm. it's not a blue that shouts out, look at me. No, it's not, it's, no. It's almost like a black because it's it's like a bit shadowy. Yeah, it's kind of licorice terms, isn't it? Yeah. So, so it's almost like a tone of black, mm. if that makes sense. No, I know exactly what um, I mean. It's like a shade. Yeah, so it, it works with, with the, the blacks that are in there. And the clear, when, when you put those flowers against oh, they're those beautiful. eye they just work yeah, they so work. nicely. They really, really do. Um, and the great thing about this kit is you can add anything to, anything to it that you want, any colour yeah. that you want, and it's going to work beautifully, yeah. isn't it? It will. It will. Isn't I mean, that fantastic? You could, you could go down the really dramatic with, the, with reds and, and pinks. <sighs> nice idea. Or you could put in some, some stronger blues. Um, and bring that out so it's um, it's a lovely kit design wise what are your ideas what kind of ideas do you have for kind of you know what are you going to make out of this challenge kit because you're um, going to be making pieces today well I thought I'd start with with the graduated um, strand. strand and I've, I've started I'm not in it because I'm mm. going to use are you going to use the temporary strands? Ah. yeah um, because and then I'm going to do some some sort of macrame thing with it. Ooh, nice! Um, so we'll see how that develops around the front. But it just be macrame down the sides, and then that sounds um, really nice. Using the wire, so mm. that's that's what's come into my head first. The fact but you've got 20 meters of this wire in this oh, in this brilliant. incredible kit is just incredible. And and also the carved leaves. What do you think of these? Yeah, um, uh, Deb, the I love I think them. They're gorgeous. They feel really nice. Mm. They make a really nice strand of worry beads, actually. Oh yeah, fantastic! It'd be really, um, really nice. Yeah, because fantastic. Because they're they're, um, they're soft and yes. they, they're sort of curved. The set and your thumb just fits into them nicely. You think if they are a it is a really really tactile strand. It this is. Um, this strand of um, of um, carved leaves. They're really beautiful. And because it's organic glass as opposed to um, a gemstone that's formed in the ground, um, they feel a little bit different. They feel mm. almost a bit like um, a bit like amber. I think slightly warm to yes, touch. Not as a cold. Bit yeah. Yeah. Not as not as cold as some of the gemstones which you might have worked with in the past. Quite seriously, this kit is flying out the door. So many of you have come through to get this, which is great to see. And do you know what? Even more of you are going to come through and get this kit when you see the jewelry that Deb has made because of course we're going to be seeing jewelry towards the end of the show that Deb has made from this kit as well so fantastic absolutely incredible right Deb I'm going to head over here okay see you later have fun <laughs> if there was anything I, 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 I could suggest to go with um, that incredible kit it would be some gorgeous spacer beads yeah it would be some gorgeous spacer beads wouldn't it be amazing if we had some spacer beads yeah uh, we've got a text in. Uh, are there any 925 Sony Silver Finals on the show today? Wouldn't that be great? You know, that'd be great if we had some silver findings on the show today, wouldn't it? Be great if we had some 95 Sterling Silver Spacer Beads on the show today, wouldn't it? Because that would go so beautifully with the challenge kit, wouldn't it? Yeah. What are these? <laughs> 95 Sterling Silver Spacer Beads. Oh, yeah! Here we go! Here we go! Right, this is seriously special. Um, I've only seen these a couple of times on Jewelry Maker before, this kind of um, idea, this kind of theme, and I love it. Really, really love it. Where are my, uh, where are my tweezers? Where are the, there they are. Tweezers are here. We've got loads of text to read out as well. So many people have been sending in really weird, really weird <laughs> food combinations. <laughs> Kim says she's never going to eat again. Some of them are truly weird. Ooh. Baked beans and salads. 
Ooh. No, I don't think I, I. I don't think I'd go for that. I like baked beans and Thousand Island dressing. Okay. That's nice. Right. Yeah. How on earth did you find that you like that? I uh, just put it on one day. <laughs> just thought, yeah, go. I for just it. tried Slap it out. It on. <laughs> just tried it out. <laughs> why not? Nah, why not? Have you ever eaten a dog biscuit before? No. I did it for a dare once. They just taste like biscuits. Dare yeah, yeah. <laughs> Right. 925, I'll do anything for a dare. Uh, 925 sterling silver spacer beads. Right. Precious metal gives you um, something very special. Precious metal quality, so i.e. silver, gold, white gold, rose gold, yellow gold, platinum, it gives you something very, very special. It can give you real inherent value. I don't know if you've, um, if whenever you go into a jeweler's, if they sell precious metal, they tend to keep it to one side. They tend to keep it, um, they tend to keep all the gold together, all the silver together, all the platinum together. You will notice a huge difference, price point wise, between uh, buying base metals um, or coat or, or, or even precious metal plated base metals and, and then your precious metals. So whether it's silver plated copper, you'll notice a very different price point um, in, in, in jewellers between silver plated copper and silver. And rightly so. It's a precious metal quality that you're getting. Precious metal quality is, is, is just that, it is precious. Now, 925 sterling silver, as the detail suggests here, means that these spacer beads are made from 92.5% pure silver. If it was 100% pure silver, you'd have something very, very soft indeed, and it, and it wouldn't really be suitable um, uh, to set with jewellery. We have in the past had um, him uh, have um, had um, uh, the Hill Tribe uh, collection that we had, which was 99.9% .9 pure silver. You do need something else with the silver as well, otherwise it becomes too soft to use. So 92.5% uh, pure silver is 95 sterling silver. If you get sterling silver on the high street, that's what it is, it's 95 sterling silver, okay? Um, the spacer beads that you've got here are quite, they are beautiful. The, the attention to detail is outstanding. Now there are 30 95 sterling silver beads here. You get three different designs. I'll just kind of separate them out. You get three different designs here now here we go one two three these are beautiful ten in each design and they are the attention to detail is quite serious it is it is incredible you get this kind of half stardust half polished rond um, uh, spacer bead look at that isn't that beautiful because of course you're getting loads of different edges and facets and because sterling silver is the world's most reflective precious metal you're going to get so much shine, so much luster, so much of that metallic shine. And these are precious metal, okay? Please don't forget that. And when you do go to sell these pieces on, when you do go to give these to a friend for a birthday present, please make them aware it is 95 sterling silver. It is a precious metal. The second design is just gorgeous. I don't know if you've ever been to Epcot Center. Reminds me a little of Epcot Center. They're like um, disco balls. They're absolutely beautiful. All these does tens and tens of different facets on this beautiful spacer bead, 10 of these. And you also get these, which are just gorgeous. I love these, these are a little bit more spiky, a little bit more contemporary, these ones, 10 of these as well. There's 30 spacer beads in total. The necklace that Deb is uh, making at the moment, so just with the black agate, she's gonna be doing some macrame around the side. Um, when you when you get uh, when you use gemstones like black gemstones or very very dark gemstones and you're looking to lift that piece of jewelry using something like a spacer bead just to either side of of a pendant or or sporadically throughout that piece throughout that necklace or or throughout that bracelet piece it can really lift that piece of jewelry not only that but it can take the look of your jewelry up three or four or five notches and it can make your jewelry look so much more professional so much more expensive and so much more um, uh, designer, if you know what I mean. Gives it that kind of designer flair. So many of you who are coming in now are multi-buying. Caroline from Cambridge, you're great to see you this morning. You've come in to get three lots of these. Katie from Cornwall, you've already come in to get two. Good morning to you, my love. Catherine from Yorkshire, hi to you. You've come in to get two lots. Kim from Oxford, too, you've come in to get two. Margaret from Middlesex, you've come in to get two. Julie from Lancashire, you've also come in to get two packs of these as well. And that is because the deal we're gonna offer you 
today is incredible. What should be almost 17 pounds today for all 30 of these beads is absolutely incredible. 9.95 for 30, for 30. 925 sterling silver beads. All of a sudden, loads of you on the website have started to check your baskets out because you've noticed and you've realized, hang on a minute, 995 for 30, 925 sterling silver spacer beads. And just let me remind you again, this is precious metal. If you watch any of our sister channels here at the Jenny Wynn Gemstone Company and you know we're selling precious metal pieces, we are either selling um, yellow gold, white gold, rose gold, platinum, or 925 sterling silver. This is exactly what this is. It's the same silver um, um, that I've got a ring made out of that I've had for the last seven years and it still looks as good as the day that I first bought it. It's meant to be hard wearing. It's meant to be workable. It's meant to be pliable. But most of all, it is precious. It is a precious metal. Carol from Dorset, good morning to you. Well, have you come in to get two lots? Patricia from Kent's coming to get two. Loads of you are multi-buying, which is fantastic. We've got less than 60 chances left now. Um, Deb, there is a... I know we go on and on and on and on and on about precious metal here on Jewelry Maker, but it is so important to realise that precious metal is just that. It's precious, mm -hmm. isn't it? It really it is. is. Yeah. And and there are so many people who buy pieces of jewellery from craft fairs who um who who are prepared to pay that little bit extra because it is precious metal. Well it's if you if you think about it, the earth has got a finite amount of resources in it. And Good call, yeah. The the silver that we use here in jewellery making is has, has actually got other applications in industry. So Absolutely. everybody's after the same resource. Yes. So it does have a real value, mm. not just for the jewellery that you're making, mm -hmm. but on a wider sort of commodities sort of basis. If Absolutely, you like. yes. Um, and the fact that that's been dug out of the ground and then refined and made into those um, spacer beads and uh, that that all has has um, an impact on the value that we should put on it massively really. so massively so and if you and if you go onto independent websites and you can you can look where you like when we are open we are transparent if you if you look on independent websites and you and you track the price of gold um, not even on a daily basis, on a monthly mm. basis, on a yearly basis, since the recession hit in 2008, you will see the gold, pr gold prices going up and down, up, 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 down, 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 down. Yeah. It, it's incredible. Prices are always moving on, on, on commodities like precious metals. But precious metals, they, they always seem, uh, they always appear to kind of retain some kind of value, whether it's inherent value for you, uh, whether it's whether it's people being prepared to pay that little bit extra because of precious metal, but Deb is right. Um, with precious metal quality, you know, you're getting something very special here, and it's something which you should never be flippant about. Never undersell yourself, and if you do sell your precious metals on, mm. advertise the fact. That bundle is now um, all been allocated. Well done to all of you who've come in to get that. Most of you, interestingly enough, have multi bought that, which is absolutely fantastic. Um, and if you haven't checked your baskets out, chances are is it might have been taken out your basket. It's as, it, it, you know, it's, as, it, 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 it's as good as having a wish list. You've got to, got to, got to, got to, got to check out your baskets. Right, text here from Katie in Cornwall. Hi, Katie, you came in for that last game. Hi. Uh, Katie from Cornwall says, uh, when I was younger, I used to drink, uh, sorry, I used to dunk rich uh, tea biscuits in lemonade. I hated hot drinks, but still wanted to dunk my rich tea. Katie, I think you might be on your own with that one. I think you might be, love. But fantastic, thank you very much. You did exactly what we asked, which is sending your weird food uh, combos. Uh, anonymous, okay, they're clearly, they're clearly ashamed by this. Uh, hi, Debbie and Carol. Uh, my family think, uh, lie, uh, think I'm weird uh, because I love Brussels sprouts omelettes. Mmm, yum. LOL, great show. Love from Jackie in Basingstoke. Um, I, I like that. Brussels sprouts, I like omelettes. Why shouldn't you put them together? I've, had, um, I've, I've made omelettes with lettuce in. That's that a bit strange. No, it's nice. <laughs> Your face. No, it, it is. It's really tasty. the lady who has honey and cheese sandwiches. So, so Brussels sprouts in an omelette. I'm going to give that a go. Okay. I might give it a go as well. Okay. Uh, uh, hi, Carol. Have you tried cheese on toast after cool, after oh. cool spread marma oh, marmalade oh. on the top? It's gorgeous. Oh. Promise. Oh, that's another one for Melissa. Well, that would be like cheese and honey, wouldn't it? <laughs> it would, yeah. 
Yeah, I can okay. see that. You are sending in some weird texts today. Kim says she's never going to eat again. Emma from Lincoln just says, <laughs> mushy pea and ketchup sandwich, dreamy. Do you know what? I Yeah. With no. Maybe some fish fingers in there as well. Fish finger sandwiches with some mushy peas, bit of tartar sauce, bit of ketchup. Yum. And why not try a little bit of... I don't know. I was trying to think of something really weird to put on it then. Anyway, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. <laughs> We're all strange enough here. We don't need to make it any stranger. Right, first kit. Brand new kit, everyone. Here we go. This kit is called The Bright Side. And I tell you what, there are some seriously bright gemstones in here. They all work beautifully. Um, I know that Deb absolutely loves working with rose gold. Uh, rose gold is my favourite precious metal. Rose gold is basically where you get... Um, where you get white gold that's got a copper element which has been added to it so you get this wonderful rose coloured gold um, it is my absolute favourite precious metal the great thing about rose gold it suits every single skin tone whether you've got uh, beautiful olive skin whether you've got very fair skin whether you've got very very dark skin uh, whether you've got more peachy undertones um, or more pinky undertones it suits every single skin tone so if you're looking to make that special piece of jewelry for somebody's birthday or somebody or, or, or you're looking for that piece which is going to suit everyone guaranteed rose gold the findings in this kit are rose gold plated copper brilliant okay strands of gemstones here we go purple dyed quartz faceted rondelles these are delicious proper black current color really really gorgeous loads and loads of luster really beautiful deep dark tones next strand fuchsia faceted dyed quartz faceted rondelles really really bright really really powerful now now okay very very bright very very powerful this is where this kit changes because you've got very, very bright, very, very powerful colours here. The other two strands and the findings, everything, and you'll see in the jewellery that Deb has made, by mixing it with this kit and with the other um, strands of gemstones, all of a sudden this kit becomes really, really sophisticated. Have a look at the next strands. Moonstone wheels. These are beautiful. Bright white moonstone with Schiller. Shilla, shilla, shilla. This is rainbow moonstone you're going to be getting here. So not just white moonstone, but rainbow moonstone. So expect to get a rainbow shilla. Shilla is light um, shining through the gemstone, reflecting off the inner layers inside the gem and giving you blues, giving you pinks, giving you peaches, giving you a whole spectrum of colours. Beautiful rainbow moonstone wheels here. There's a load of them on this strand as well, which is great. Next strand, you can see it there. It's the most beautiful strand it looks metallic doesn't it they look like metallic beads now is this hematite or is this coated pyrite no really that's incredible it looks just like hematite doesn't it it's silver coated pyrite sorry um silver colored pyrite absolutely incredible quality look at how metallic that is it's gorgeous isn't it Stunning, stunning genuine gemstone strand there. Now, without those two strands, it's very bright, it's very powerful. With these two strands, that looks really, really awesome, really quite sophisticated, doesn't it? Wait till you see the findings. Rose gold plated copper findings here, 115 in total. There they are. I want to show you the chain in this. The chain in this kit, a meter of chain in this kit. I think this kit's got something. This kit's got something in it for everyone, whether you are um, whether you are um, 17 or whether you're 70, because you've got gemstones in here which are bright and beautiful and powerful and very youthful. But you've also got the elegance of the rose gold. You've got the beauty of this gorgeous silver colour pyrite, and of course the ethereal quality of the moonstone to really elevate this kit as well. 115 findings and your threading pack as well with monofilament beading thread and elastic. There it is. Now, everything in this kit together should be 40 pounds 20p well that sounds pretty good doesn't it that sounds pretty good doesn't it today this should have been your price now at 26 pounds 95p at 26 pounds 95p this really was pushing it this was at the absolute lowest price we could bring this kit to you at and then kim said Do you know what we are literally half an hour late for the show today. 
21.95 for this kit 21.95 that is a whopping whopping amount of money off what this should be what should have been almost 42 pounds is now 21.95 that is almost 20 pounds off where we should have been if you if you bought everything separately from our website today it's almost 20 pounds more than the price where we're at. That is absolutely sensational. Now, I don't know about you, Deb, but I, I just think, I mean, I, I just think this kit has got something in it if you're, if you're 17, because it's got those beautiful, powerful colors in, those bright, punchy colors. But if you're, if you're 70, if you're, if, you're, um, if you're 30, if you're 170, th there's something in this kit as well, because it's really quite refined with that silver colored, um, pyrite and with the moonstone and the rose gold findings are beautiful aren't they they are um, and because of the size of all of the the gems in the kit mm. um, they actually do all work together and just having um, sort of one or two little flashes of the the bright pink mm. um, you could mix it in all the way so through beautiful but I liked the purple and the pink together. Yeah, the purple and the pink look awesome together with the rose gold uh, plated findings actually that that looks, it, 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 it changes, it changes the look of the yes. pink and the purple together. Yeah. It, it kind of calms them down a little bit. It, it kind of refines them a little bit, doesn't it? Yeah, no, I agree. It's beautiful. I love what you've done here. Is this, is this the lather weave that you've done here? It is, yeah. So it starts off um, at, the, at the front point as mm. a standard um, four beads right. in the weave. And then I just added extra of the, um, the purple. Mm. The purple to, dye cords. To lengthen it out as yeah. it went around the neck. And do you know what? Interestingly enough, Deb, I don't know if you've noticed, because I know that you watch the show when you're not here. Yeah. Um, um, interestingly enough, all of our kits recently that have had the really, really petite gemstones in have all flown out the door. And I think it's because a lot of people are into making designs like this at the minute, whether it's using the bead loom, whether it's doing things like, like the ladder weave. Designs like this are everywhere at the minute. Look at this. Deb has hardly used any gemstones in this design, but it's such a beautiful, striking piece, isn't it? It's gorgeous. I love this piece, Deb. It's really lightweight. Mm. Sometimes when it's really hot in the summer, you want something that's got impact, yeah. but you don't want a lot of weight around your neckline. You're right, yeah. Um, and, it, and it's got the impact from the design and also from um, that incredible yeah. colour. This bracelet, this bracelet is loads of fun. This is gorgeous. That's just a dead sim simple stretchy. Um, so the elastic goes through those pink beads really mm. easily. Gorgeous. Which is brilliant. Stunning. And then you've got um, these two pieces here, which are definitely kind of more of your evening pieces. I love them. I love the way you've used the purple with the rose gold as well. Mm. That's stunning. Isn't that gorgeous? Yeah. Made um, almost like a lace section for the pendant yeah. drop there. Yeah, it's um, gorgeous. Really stunning designs, gorgeous kit, twenty one ninety five. Uh, this kit has been really, really popular. I think it's got a lot to do with the mix of the gemstones mm. and also the findings and of course Deb's design as well. Really, really stunning designs. Um, Unfortunately, we can't see a demo on this kit just purely because we were literally half an hour late for the show today. I'm sorry, Dad. That's all right. I'm sorry, Dad. That's, that's fine. <laughs> oh, lovely, lovely. That means you've got more time on your challenge. I have, yes. Yeah! <laughs> more time on a challenge. Right. How about a strand of genuine gemstones with a price slash? Whoosh, yeah. Here we go. So, faceted pairs. Pink colour coated. Is this the right one? Are you sure this is the one we're doing the price slash on? You're kidding me. Right, were you watching the show yesterday? Were you watching the show yesterday? If you were watching the show yesterday and you saw some of the price points that we did our strands for yesterday, um, then we've got a similar theme running through today's show as well. We honestly, honestly, honestly do. Look at the quality of the gemstones you've got here. Can you see how each one has been individually fastened? It's beautiful, isn't it? You've got roughly three, six, nine, twelve, uh, fifteen, about sixteen of these on this strand. It's beautiful, isn't it? Really subtle pink. In fact, it would go beautifully with the kit that Jeb's, uh, 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 that, um, uh, that Deb's just um, showed us with those beautiful pinks, those hot purples as well, the rose gold. It would go so beautifully with that stunning first kit, wouldn't it? Now, does this look like a strand of gemstones that should be going under 20 pounds? Doesn't, does it? Would you like to see where we should be today? Now, 11 pounds 95p for this strand is where we should be. 
No, we shouldn't. We shouldn't be anywhere near this price point. The quality, individually hand faceted, genuine gemstones, top drilled faceted drops. That is sensational, isn't it? 11.95 apparently is where we should be. Really? We're gonna give you a price slash. Guess where we're going today? We're going under a tenner. And if you're thinking 9.95, think again. 8.95 for this. Oh my word, I have got so many people coming through on the web and the phone lines to come in and get this. Do you know what, it's one of those strands, isn't it, that you look at, everybody, we can't help it, but as soon as you see something in a shop, you walk into a shop, I walked into a shop the other day, um, and I saw a handbag on the shelf, because I went handbag shopping, uh, and I saw a handbag and I thought, oh, that's a gorgeous handbag, that is going to be X amount. I picked it up and I was so wrong. I was so wrong. I thought, do you know what, I've been looking at handbags today and you know, there seems to be a rough kind of a price point. I thought this handbag's gonna be about 200 pounds. I saw it and I thought, that's gonna be 200 pounds, yeah? Picked it up, it was over 2,000 pounds. I almost fell over, I went, ooh, and did this really weird noise that made the security guard go, ooh, and then put it back on the shelf. Um, and it made me realize that I had no reason to be in that shop at all. It really was just, it was terrible. I should have known when I walked in and the carpet, I could feel the carpet it under my shoes you know you feel it kind of move because it's got that really high pile I thought I've got no business being in this shop at all so I left the premises and went and had a coffee and a sit down <laughs> two thousand pounds for a handbag um, but this is one of those strands isn't it that you look at and you think right that's going to be that's going to be 24.95 and then we bring in a price point of 8.95 and do you know what you want to Loads of you are coming through to get to. Patricia from Ayrshire, Julie from Lancashire, Veronica from Nottinghamshire, Barbara from Lancashire, Carol, uh, sorry, uh, a caller from Devon, Christine from Lincolnshire as well. You've all come through to get to. Your names are going off the screen at the minute. There is no way that I would ever put a price point of 8.95 on any one of these gemstones, let alone a whole strand. It's a nice, pleasant surprise, isn't it? Really nice, pleasant surprise. But quite often it happens, doesn't it? You know, you, you go into those shops, you see that jacket, you see that pair of jeans, and you think, that's going to be the price point. You pick it up, look at the price tag quite often. Do you know what? It's nowhere near the price point you thought it was going to be. Quite often it's a lot higher, isn't it? Well, here at Jewelry Maker, it's the same thing, but quite often it's a lot lower. 8.95. So many of you are saying, yeah, most of you are multi buying. Jill from Lancashire, you just multi bought. That's great to see. Well done, my love. Really, really fantastic. Right, still got you coming through for this. Hold those lines, I've still got 20 chances left if you want to add it to your order. But if you check out your baskets, that quantity is gonna go down a lot, lot lower. We'll see you over at the Wall of Fame. We've got loads to get through. I'll see you over there. Fame. This is a gorgeous colourful piece, uh, number 128, sent in by uh, Lynn from Wigan, who says hi to all uh, the crew at Jewellery Maker. Hi. Here's my first attempt at a wire work flower. It's not perfect, but I'll get there eventually. Poppy agate, wire and findings, all from Jewellery Maker, of course. Hope it's good enough for your wall. Uh, good luck to everyone, especially me. Lynn from Wigan. Well, Lynn, at least you're honest. Uh, but that's gorgeous. And for a first attempt, for a, for a 20th attempt, that would be amazing. For a first attempt, that's absolutely incredible. Well done, my love. And best of luck. Oh, it's a comb. We've got combs it's on today's show. Yep. Wait until you see what it's going to be worn for. 129. Mm. Um, it's from Jan Green. Hi, Jan. She says, I discovered Jewelry Maker at Christmas and am hooked. I made this comb for a friend who's been invited to a Buckingham Palace <gasps> garden party no. in June. Oh. <laughs> She's going to wear it to the garden <laughs> party? Yeah. <gasps> It's made with freshwater pearls and a couple of other beads from my stash. I'm having so much fun making things for friends and family. And that's love from Jan from Yorkshire. The Queen Isn't might that see that. The Queen yeah. might touch that. Yeah, yeah. The Queen well, might go, where did you get that from? <laughs> jewelry maker. She does that? <laughs> hmm? Just walks up to people and grabs the Where did the you get jewelry. that? Where's <laughs> that from? <laughs> I can't imagine the Queen doing that, but anyway. No. Number 130. <laughs> this is a great idea of what to do with the uh, early bird that we just bought you. Mm. Uh, from Sheila Pryor. Attaches uh, a photo of three rose quartz pendants featuring uh, faceted labradorite, a quartz star, uh, a faceted hematite respectively. All materials are from Jewelry Maker. And that's from Sheila Pryor. Sheila, they're absolutely gorgeous. Stunning. 
Just shows you what you can do with those big pendants, doesn't it? Stunning. And your number 130, best of luck. 131 is from Julia Lees, and she says, Hi all at JM, happy birthday. Oh, lovely. This week's entry is my vintage corsage make. No, it's not. I've added letters in there. <laughs> <laughs> She's making it up now. <laughs> I am, yeah. <laughs> Ad libbing. This week's entry is my vintage course make. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Enjoyed it very much. Thanks, Gemma Crow. Kiss, kiss. <laughs> By the way, Deb Rudge is incredible. It doesn't say that, Deb. It doesn't say that. You're making it up. I know, yeah. <laughs> Terrible. Uh, oh. I can't trust her. Uh, number 132. <laughs> I love the display of these. This is gorgeous. Yes. Sent in uh, by Angela, who says, Hi to everyone at Jewelry Maker. If my entry were to have a title, it could possibly be as pretty as a picture of Jasper. Uh, I like that. <laughs> um, I've used rounds, carved flowers, puffy squares, and a triangular prism uh, of picture Jasper. This gem always reminds me of summer and beaches because of its sandy appearance. Oh, me too. Um, all beads and white are from Jewelry Maker. That's gorgeous. And best of luck to you, my love. Now, if you want to know how to enter the Wall of Fame, uh, if you want to know how to enter the Wall of Fame, here's how to do it. <laughs> the Jewellery Maker Wall of Fame is where you get to showcase your skills as a jewellery designer. Each week, one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their account and the runner-up receives £50. If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jewellerymaker.com or you can post your photos to Wall of Fame, The Genuine Gemstone Company, Unit 2D, Eagle Road, Moon's Moat, Redditch, B989HF. Get making and good luck. Dremel! This is the most incredible tool. The Dremel. I cannot remember the last time this was shown on the day show. I can't remember. This is incredible. I cannot remember. This is ab this is amazing. Um, I just need to make you aware of something very, very quickly before we bring this to you. There's less than 50 in stock. Okay, so it says back in stock. It is back in stock, but there's less than 50. Okay, so you've got to be quick. Um, I remember bringing you the Dremel all those months ago. This tool is life changing, um, and, I, and I don't, you know, I don't, I don't um, use that term lightly. But it really, really is life changing. Um, so much so that there were a load of uh, presenters um, and guest designers who have bought this incredible tool, not just for themselves but for partners as well. You literally. You buy this tool and you start, to, you start to walk around your house trying to find things to Dremel. You want to use this tool. Once you get it, you want to use it. You want to use it all the time. You want to find, um, you want to find things around your house to Dremel. Now, um, uh, Deb, you have used uh, the Dremel before, haven't you? Yes. Yeah. It's, it's the most incredible tool, isn't it? It's what it does. It saves you so much time and energy. Mm. Um, and also you can use it in ways that you maybe don't think of initially. Yeah, yeah. Um, so wood carving and, and carving stones and all sorts. Yeah, all sorts. Y you literally right. can use it across so many materials. It's, it, it's unbelievable. Everything from um, etching, etching into glass. Look mm. at this. I mean, there's just an example just on the front of the, um, on the, front of the, um, on the front of the box here. Etching into glass. You can use your Dremel for doing things like that. Um, on the side here, uh, pumpkin carving. Um, you can etch onto plates. You can um, uh, cut through into, you can uh, carve onto wood. You can, it, it is absolutely amazing. Um, what I loved about this tool so much was the amount of money it was gonna save me. Having pieces of jewellery in your jewellery box over a time, uh, things like um, th things like metal um, uh, does start to oxidise. Sometimes you get mm. a piece of jewellery out your uh, jewellery box and you think, "Goodness me, that, that looks really dirty." It's not dirty; it's just it's just oxidised slightly because it's a precious metal. So you take it to your local jeweller, and who has to get that ring cleaned or that piece of jewellery cleaned or a whole load of jewellery if you want to get a load of it cleaned. Um, and uh, and they charge you I don't know fifteen twenty pounds to get it cleaned. Um, I think 
that that sounds like a lot of money. You know, time after time after time to get pieces of jewellery clean, to get pieces um, clean, to get um, to clean things like candlesticks as well. You, get, you know, metal candlesticks. You know, it, it can cost a lot of money to get them clean professionally. You can do it yourself now because with the Dremel. You can polish it with your Dremel as well. Because so it's not just like a carving and a boring tool. This little selection here does everything from polishing to buffing. So you can clean your own pieces of jewellery here. So you've got your incredible polishing set here included with the Dremel. Okay. You've got your stencils with the Dremel as well, which is fantastic. So if you do want, um, if you want to do any stenciling, any kind of carving, any kind of, um, 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 to get these awesome designs, you've got your stencils here as well, which are fantastic, great for kids. I mean, you will literally be walking around your house looking for things to Dremel. The tool itself is absolutely amazing. This one, oh no, it is charged up. Goodness me, it is charged up. Uh, <laughs> but, you, but you charge it up really, really simply and easily. It, you hold it literally like a pen. It's a very, very lightweight design. You literally hold it like a pen, just like I'm holding it now. It's so simple and easy to use. Comes with loads of different tops here. If I can show you these which are fantastic. You can drill through things uh, because you've got really, really thin, um, fine drill bits here. You can drill through things like uh, beach glass and uh, seashells. So you can uh, make your own pendants. You can drill into uh, polymer clay as well to kind of make polymer clay into pendants. I think you can actually drill into resin as well to make your own, um, uh, yeah. to make little drill holes so you can make them into charms and into pendants. It's a yeah. fantastic tool, isn't it? Yeah. Um, I use it for perspex. Ah, I'm doing great. Perspex. Um, so I bet you could use it with so uh, shrink plastic as well, probably. Yeah, yeah, I don't see why not. Yeah, so, you know, there are loads and loads and loads of uses for this. Um, there's loads more, but I haven't even got time to show you because I've already got people coming through to get this. Um, but that is a picture of everything that you're going to be getting here. It quite simply is amazing, and it comes in a great carry case as well. We're going to bring you price because we've got less than 50 of these available. Here's your deal today for the Dremel. It's fantastic. There's less than 50 of these available. Once it's gone, once it's gone, it's gone, okay? Um, we will be getting the Dremel back in stock. We will be getting different um, different adapters um, for the Dremel as well. And if you go to the Dremel website, my goodness me, you can see the most incredible demos um, 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 uh, for this tool. Um, and you can get some great ideas as well. There are loads of inspiration ideas as well. It might be on our YouTube channel. On our, on our YouTube channel, there might be demos for the Dremel on our YouTube channel when it was first launched. Um, but um, but but do uh, but do go onto uh, YouTube, type in demos for Dremel, and you, you, there'll be loads and loads and loads of suggestions. It's a fantastic, fantastic tool, and it does come with instructions as well. Uh, we've got a few pictures to show you of examples of of what can be done with the Dremel, what what was done live on the show. So uh, the polishing uh, technique that I was talking about, uh, using this polishing set, which is included with that price of seventy nine ninety five, and. Um, the ring on the left, can you see half and half on the front there? Um, you've got half a kind of an unpolished ring and then you've got, and then you've got the, um, and then you've got the, um, and then you've got uh, part of the ring which is uh, much more shiny. The pendant on the right hand side was really, really tarnished before as well, uh, before it was polished. Um, also engraving onto glass, this is what it can look like and it looks so beautiful. Look at that, you can um, um, put whatever you want on there. Um, literally, if you just get a piece of tracing paper, Put it over the font that you want, uh, trace it on there, and then you can and then you can engrave your own glasses. I don't know if you've ever had um, tumblers um, engraved. If you go to your local key cutting place, it can cost an awful lot of money. You can do it yourself now with the Dremel. It's fantastic. Um, engraving onto wood as well looks fantastic. It looks really, really, really wonderful. Isn't that gorgeous? So you can engrave onto plain uh, wooden bangles, and also drilling holes as well. So if you want to drill through uh, seashells or beach glass or perspex, or uh, shrink plastic, or polymer clay, you can do that as well. It really is the most fantastic tool. And you literally start wandering around your house looking for things to Dremel. It's, a bit, it, it's as addictive as Swelligant, I think. It's really, really <laughs> fantastic. Just wonderful. And it comes with a DVD as well, which has got the world of the Dremel as well. There are loads of different adapters you can get as well. And what I've often found as well, um, from speaking to a number of you who've come through to get the Dremel before, and a number of our guest designers, like Debbie Bulford, who I know bought the Dremel, um, her husband uses it more than her. You know, it, it, it's one of those tools that the whole family will end up using. It really is fantastic. Well done. So, 79.95, less than 50, less than 40 of these available now. So, so do make sure that you're coming and get that. It really is an absolutely fantastic tool and something which I would recommend um, not just getting if you're into jewelry making, but any kind of craft. It really is wonderful if you're into any kind of craft. And I've only shown you a little percentage of what there is it's, um, as part of this Dremel. I've only shown you a little percentage. 
of, of what there is in this Dremel. There is so much more as well. It's just fantastic. Oh, right, pop all that to one side. Now, I've got the return of the Wags Wycone. This has not been shown on the day show for over a month. Um, this is an absolutely incredible tool. It's wonderful. An absolutely incredible tool. Um, it hasn't been seen on the day show for over a month. Quite often the tools that we bring you on Jewelry Maker are very, very simple in design, very, very simple to use, but they are going to save you time, energy, and sometimes money as well. This incredible tool is going to save you all of those. Now, Deb, you um, do lots of pieces of wire work, don't you? Yes. Yeah. How important has the Wags Wycone been for you? Because I know that you kind of do lots of different, you, you do lots of different mediums, so things like yeah. macrame, polymer clay, um, and, 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 um, and wire work. How have you found the Wags Wycone useful? It it finishes off bits of macrame, um, kumahimo cord. You can make wire cones with ah. it, and it gives a nice professional finish at the end of your braiding, whatever okay. form it is you, you're braiding. Um, so that's, I think, sometimes um, with uh, macrame and kumahimo, mm -hmm. it, there's a tendency for the finishing off Yes. To be a bit sloppy sometimes. Yes, absolutely. You have to be really careful that you, you've done it well. Otherwise, you, you can ruin a piece that you've spent ages putting together. Do you know what? That's a really good point, actually, Deb. When, when, when you buy anything, when you buy anything either from a shop, whether it's a, pet or whether it's a gorgeous dress, if the zip is, yeah. is, is rubbish quality and it's been finished off really badly, you're probably not going to buy it because it's been finished off really badly. If you buy a coat and the hem comes down after the first time you wear it, you know, you're not going to go back to that shop and buy another one. The same goes for jewellery. The same goes for jewellery. Um, um, if you have that finishing touch, if you finish off your jewellery professionally, people, uh, people are more likely to come back to you again and again and again. Mm. And this is how it works. You simply pop your wire through the hole. This is such a simple tool to use. Pop your wire through the hole and you hold your wire in place. There you go. And you just literally start turning the Wags Y cone. It is that simple. I wish it was more complicated. <laughs> I wish there was some secret knack, um, but it really is. It literally is that simple. Uh, we've had a, a FIFO comment, which is great. Thanks a lot for, um, to Susan, uh, who has bought the Wags Y cone, who says, been after this for ages. Love the look in wire work jewelry, Kumihimo, Viking knit, multi-strand necklaces, bracelets, the possibilities are endless. I'm going to use these uh, with gems uh, and wire and uh, beads too. Again, the design aspect regarding the cone uh, shapes are endless too. You get such a professional finish. Look at the finish on that incredible cone. Um, Christina, uh, who's also bought this product, says, looking forward to using this tool. Been jewelry making for a while and never seen this tool before. It's a no brainer. Easy to use and produces excellent results. Mm -hmm. Now, those are two comments from two ladies who have bought this product. This tool is that simple to use. Look, you just simply snip it off. There you go, there's your excess, which is a tiny amount of excess. And there you have that incredible cone. Then that is your, that is your bead cap. That is your end piece to attach a clasp onto. It is simple, it is so easy to use. Now, a tool is, is only gonna be, a tool is only gonna be as popular as, it's only gonna be popular if, if there is a fantastic price point attached to it, okay? It is very, very useful. So many of you have bought this in the past. So many of you are on the phones already. Maybe you've never seen this tool before. Maybe you've heard people going on about this tool on our Facebook page, going on and on, on about how fantastically useful it is, how, it is, how simple and easy it is to use. And this is the first time you've seen it. This is the first time this, um, this tool has been on the day show for over a month. As with all of the tools here on Jewelry Maker, if we can give you a fantastic price, we will. And today, this is your deal. Seven ninety-five. 
7.95. Do you know what? This tool, if you're into your um, anything from macrame to multi-strand necklaces to wire work mm. to, oh my goodness me, to, really any kind of medium if you're into your jewelry making this will become as essential as your toolkit this will become as essential as your round nose pliers this will become as essential as your beading thread it's one of those tools that you will just wonder how you ever got on without it not to mention it's just going to save you so much time because making coils like this by hand without the use of the wags y cone it, it you, you're not going to get that uniform quality and it's going to take you a long, long, long time. You can make um, uh, coils like this using your round nose pliers, but how are you going to anchor it at the top? It's so difficult to anchor the wire at the top of the coil, isn't yeah. it? And also, um, with your round nose pliers, they tend to be um, a different shape to that. Well, they tend to be a lot thinner, so don't they? Yeah, they're a lot thinner, um, whereas that flares quite nicely. It does, doesn't so it? So you can fit more cords or beads through. Yeah. Yeah, it is absolutely fantastic. This tool, I remember the first time we launched it and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of these were allocated. And we've got a couple of you who are multi-buying, which is great to see. If you do want to multi-buy, if maybe you uh, run a beading group or you know, ah, oh, do you know what? That's going to be the perfect Prezi for my friend who does loads of wire work pieces. Um, have we got any examples of, of the of the Wags wide cone kind of in use on a piece of drawing? I'm just looking over here. Um, um, you know the kind of, you know, the kind of cones on the ends of the pieces I, of jewellery? Because like you're not seeing any. It's really tricky, isn't it? It's, it, it's tricky because we don't have all the guest designers jewellery out. And we're just going to see whether we can find um, um, any necklaces or bracelets where the Wags Y cone has been used to make a clasp on the end. Um, but it just gives your jewellery that really professional, uh, 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 professional finish. If, as Deb suggested, you've got a multi-strand necklace, what's going to look more professional? Five strands of beading thread all coming together, going through a jump ring and through a crimp bead, or hiding all of that mechanism by by a gorgeous coil that's been made by the Wags Y cone. It's going to give that professional finish. It's like when you uh, buy a dress, the zip is either exposed at the back and it looks a little bit rubbish, or um, they kind of um, um, put um, put like a little flap over the zip so you can't see the zip at the back, and, and it hides all the workings, it hides all the mechanisms, and you get a much smoother, much nicer finish, and a much better quality finish. I've got a beautiful piece here, which wouldn't have been able, you just simply wouldn't have been able to finish this piece off to anywhere near the standard if it wasn't for the Wags Y cone. Look at this. Making coils like this to go on huge pieces of jewellery like this, uh, like this um, felt piece it simply wouldn't be possible if it wasn't for things like the Wags Y cone. You know, it's really is fan a fantastic, fantastic, fantastic tool. I love that piece of jewellery. That's gorgeous. It really is fantastic. So, um, seven ninety five, a fantastic tool. Thanks, darling. Um, loads of you are coming through to get this, which is great to see. Doesn't surprise me at all. I think it's wonderful. I think it's great. I think you need to get one, basically. There we go. Fantastic. Right, now, next. This, sorry, say again. The cones. So I don't know what you were going on about there. I thought you said cones. Cones and tubes. I thought, what on earth is she going on about? <laughs> right, okay. <laughs> Combs, as in comb your hair. Right, yesterday um, on the show, we were chatting a lot um, about a really, really exciting matrix bundle that we had. The matrix bundle that we had um, had beautiful faceted pair drops of, um, oh goodness me, there was blue topaz, there was peridot, there was mystic quartz, there was white quartz, there were loads and loads and loads of gorgeous genuine gemstones in that gorgeous uh, matrix collection. And we were talking loads about putting all those gemstones together, putting them in a hair comb or in a beautiful hair vine and creating a really beautiful multi-gem piece of jewellery. I didn't know that on today's show, we'd be bringing you gemstones and accessories, which meant you could make something like this. Now, on today's show, uh, this has been made by Rosanna. On today's show, we've got a really, really special deal for you. A really, really special deal. Um, 
the gemstones you're getting as part of this deal are beautiful and I remember the first time I bought you one of these deluxe gem selections it was on my birthday last year so close to a year ago because my birthday's next Friday by the way all presents gratefully Ooh. received <laughs> I'm joking uh, but no my birthday is next Friday I'll be 33 <clears throat> and um, yeah yeah and um, and I remember bringing you the very first deluxe gem selection I ever I ever bought to you, um, and it was bought down in a in a package like this. I thought, oh, that looks exciting. Looks like a very nice chocolate bar, you know, the kind of <laughs> triangular prison shaped chocolate bars. But it wasn't chocolate. It was something even better because opening this out, I saw a whole mix of gemstones. We've brought you bead scoops in the past yeah we bought you bead scoops in the past of all of our uh, bead quality uh, gemstones and thousands upon thousands upon thousands of those have sold in the past this is even better you're getting a, a good handful of deluxe gemstones so if i take this out and empty these gemstones out you're getting gemstones here like garnet moonstone labradorite you're getting gemstones which are really, really special. Now, there's about 350 carats worth here. You're getting about a handful of gemstones, which is absolutely amazing. The mix of gems is really, really quite impressive. Everything from your, that looks like an eyelight to me, to a carnelian, to a gorgeous pear drop of garnet. You're getting all these incredible genuine gemstones. Now, imagine all these gemstones together in a piece of jewelry. You can make your own rosary link chain, you can make so many gorgeous pieces of jewellery. Now today, and I, I hasten to add today only really, because I don't think we're ever going to be able to bring you a deal like this again. Um, and the reason for that is, is because you're getting something else with this deal today. You're going to be getting hair combs. Now, we have not had hair combs in stock on Jewellery Maker for ages and 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 ages as part of this deal today we're going to offer you not one silver colored hair comb or even two or even three or four or five or six or seven or eight or nine we're going to offer you 10 silver colored hair combs now you can see the examples that rosanna's made here and in fact rosanna's been really uh, uh, really really clever and has made um one of the combs actually into a piece to put onto a comb which i think looks absolutely incredible i've never seen that done before i think it's gorgeous but just using a few of the gemstones along the top of the comb that all of a sudden is a hair comb for a bridesmaid, for a prom, for just every day. If you wear your hair in a, a chignon um, and, and you use hair combs a lot, or even if you wear your hair down, you can wear these hair combs so easily um, every single day of the week, even if, it's, even if it's just to work. Even if you've got short hair, you're not, you're not kind of exempt from using hair combs. Um, even Mike, Mike, even you could wear a hair comb. You could, you could, you could. You could attach a fascinator to it, you can attach all sorts to it. Having 10 hair combs, incredible. When I got married um, three years ago, um, I had a, a veil which was attached to my hair by a hair comb. That hair comb, unfortunately, was plastic. It was clear plastic. And by my wedding day, and I'd literally only tried my veil on maybe mm, half a dozen times. Um, by my wedding day, two of the, metal t uh, two of the uh, plastic teeth had fallen out. You know, it's, it, it's, it, the fact that these are metal is fantastic. It means they're going to be really nice and hard wearing. You're getting 10 of them, okay? Now, how do you fancy today? How do you fancy today getting a really special deal? The tube of gemstones on its own, and I think this is an absolutely bonanza deal. The tube of gemstones on their own, all those gems there, 12 95 It's incredible, isn't it? Less than 13 pounds for hundreds of gemstones hundreds of carats of genuine gemstones 12.95 for all those gems Are you ready to see a deal 
you're getting 10 silver colored hair combs for free. Yeah, you're getting 10 silver colored hair combs for free, for free. You're getting the hair combs for free. That's absolutely amazing. If you were in a shop, put yourself in a craft shop, put yourself in any craft shop, you've got your, you've got your bead, your deluxe gem selection, yeah? You take it to the till and the, and, and the, and the person behind the till says, oh, you get a freebie with this. And they go into the desk and they're kind of rifling around. You think, oh, great, what's it going to be? Is it going to be like a free, is it going to be something, a free, I don't know, a free plastic, a free little organza bag or a free, a free, oh no, actually that would be quite a good free gift. A free, um, oh, I don't know, something rubbish a free pencil sharpener great awesome what a great freebie and then and then they come up from behind the desk and they go no 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 you get these free what so i get one of those hair combs for free okay well that's quite a good freebie no 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 you get 10 hair combs for free 10 what so hang on all i have to do is get this deluxe gem selection here for 12.95 and i get 10 of these for free yeah well i want two of them I want two of them. We've got a corner and air shoes coming to get two. That's absolutely amazing. Twelve ninety-five for the gemstones alone, and then you get ten hair combs for free. Deb, that is a truly amazing freebie, isn't it? It is. Yeah, it's brilliant because if you try and buy them anywhere else, yeah, <laughs> it's you know they're not they're not cheap and nasty. No, um, they're not plastic. No, these are proper metal hair combs. They're going to last. They're absolutely 100% going to last. And, and they're really nicely made as well. There's no sharp bits. Because some hair combs, when you put them into your hair and you take it out, you can feel it catching everything and good point. your hair yeah. out. They don't do that. And do you know what? That's a really good point, actually, because um, some of the hair combs, actually, they're kind of like um, yeah. um, actual kind of teeth um, in the combs. What these are, rather than being teeth, is, is, is can you see how they're rounded on the end? Can you see that? How, how, how can I show you that? If I just pop my finger there, there you are, you can see that they're round. That, so it's not like um, um, teeth, as, as in single teeth going through your hair. It's little loops. It's like little loops, so they'll be nice and soft going through your hair. And as Deb says, they're not scratchy. They haven't got any hard edges. They're beautifully crafted. I mean, it's a hair comb at the end of the day, mm. but they're really beautifully crafted. As comfortable, as comfortable as a hair comb is ever going to be. You know, really, and they stay in. Yeah. <laughs> I could just forget about that. I can do. Still in. Still in. Stop come out. Still in. Prove it. Still I there. I use it for weeks Hang in on. my hair. Still in. <laughs> Stop come out. I washed my hair last night as well, so I've got clean hair. Still in. It's still in. Hasn't come out. Prove it. There it is. See, oh, my hair's come out. There we go. <laughs> just one. Uh, but seriously, 10 silver coloured hair slides, hair combs and a deluxe gem selection for the price of the deluxe gem selection on its own. Patricia, you've come in to get two. Anisha, you've come in to get two. A caller from Moray, you've come in to get two. Uh, Sionad from Ayrshire, you've come in to get two. This really is fantastic, isn't it? Fantastic, fantastic quality and an amazing, amazing deal. Almost half the stock has been allocated. And if you want to add more than one of these to your order, <laughs> are you going to be paying any more P&P, Mike? No. No? How much is the P&P? $2.95. It's two ninety five. <laughs> and how long does our 30-day money-back guarantee last for, Mike? 30 days, exactly. No flies on him. No flies on him. But quite seriously, 12.95 for your deluxe gem selection on its own, fantastic. You get the hair combs for free. If I went to a craft shop and I bought myself a deluxe gem selection for 12.95, I think I was getting a great deal, end of story. But then, but then you take it to the till and they say, oh, hang on, you get a freebie. And it's 10 hair combs for free. Amazing, amazing. Just get it. Well done. And even if you're looking at this and you're thinking, do you know what? I haven't got a use for this right now, but I can see it's a great deal. Get it. You don't have to use it now. Use it in six months' time. Use it in a year's time. You don't have to use it now. You don't have to use them together. I think it's would be great they, with a challenge they'd kit. They'd be really nice together. Um, I've used the hair combs and actually attached polymer clay to it. Um, oh, nice. And then baked it with the hair comb in. So the ah. polymer is, is then fixed onto it's, the comb. It's fused. So you can bake with these? You can, Ooh. yeah. It, um, I used the gold colour. Yeah. And it didn't affect the colour at all. Oh, fantastic. It came out just as good as when it went in the oven. Um, and if you make holes into your polymer clay when before you bake it, you can then wire your gemstones onto it as well so you you can combine the two love that idea really well. 
Love that idea. So maybe even do like a polymer clay name across the top of the comb mm. for like a little girl or something for her birthday. I like that idea. <laughs> I'd make one for Harry, but she hasn't got enough hair. She hasn't got enough hair at the minute. She's, she's just she's she's almost completely bald. Bless her. I think she's going to be bald forever. <laughs> Never mind. My sister was bald till she was two. Really? Yeah, she was pretty much bald. Till she, she was born with like a peachy fuzz, which fell out, um, and then uh, didn't really have any hair till she was two. Oh. oh no. Hattie's getting more hair. She's getting it more around the side, so it looks like she's got this really <laughs> weird kind of receding hairline thing. <laughs> she's ever so cute. Um, I, hopefully, I'm going to bring her in for the show on um, on on Sunday. <laughs> She's at a proper dribbly stage though, and also at a, like a shrieking stage. I think I told you about this the other week, where a little old lady, a really sweet little old lady came up to her and said, oh, you're a pretty little baby. Aren't you lovely? Aren't you lovely? And Hattie just looked at her and went, and just it wasn't like a horrible scream it was just like a hello I'm learning how to use my voice and it, this poor little old lady I thought she was going to have a heart attack poor thing but yeah so she might she's at a proper shrieky stage and she's starting to shuffle no Ooh. crawling shuffling like a proper bum shuffle thing she just loves it she absolutely loves it can you what? yes you can look after Hattie whilst I'm on air am I going to come am I, am I going to end up Kind of presenting a, a game though, and then and then and then go and find her. She's going to be draped in jewellery. <laughs> probably she's gonna, uh, probably going to be eating the wax white cone or something. You never know. She's got two teeth. Two teeth. Ooh. Right, we're doing the kit. What net? Oh, tell you what, white topaz. Now this is seriously, seriously beautiful. Um. Hmm. White topaz. Look at how clear and beautiful this is. Full of clarity, full of brilliance, faceted, graduated wheels of white topaz isn't that just gorgeous they look like diamonds don't they they really do look di like diamonds um white topaz you know you can have clear topaz white topaz um to get it with this little color um is is actually a lot more difficult than it sounds with white topaz quite often you get lots of yellows you get lots of mineral inclusions uh you get uh, different shades of kind of creaminess and ivoriness and and, and, and and sometimes blues and greens going through white topaz. Very, very seldom is it this colourless. That's really very, very special indeed. I think to use with the deal that we just bought you with all those gorgeous hair combs, you know, absolutely fantastic. Oh, sorry, there's a runaway gemstone. Uh, to use it with um, pearls, to use it for a bridal project. Absolutely fantastic. Fact of the matter is, this is one of the this is one of those strands of white topaz that has got almost zero colour and almost zero mineral inclusions, making it a very, very highly prized strand, making it a very highly coveted strand. Now, surely for a strand like this that looks so close to diamonds, that looks absolutely, it looks, it looks purer than pure, doesn't it? Look at all that brilliance. Can you see how the light is just going into the gemstone, bouncing around on the inside facets of the gem and reflecting back at you just like a diamond would. It's giving you the same kind of clarity, the same kind of adamantine luster that a diamond would, isn't it? Can you see that? It's beautiful, isn't it? Giving you that clear, crystal clear quality that a, that a top quality flawless diamond would give you. If this was a strand of diamonds, my word, you'd be you'd be lucky to get it for uh, six figures, let alone seven figures. You know, this, this really would be a priceless strand of diamonds, wouldn't it, if it, if it was diamonds. It's not, it's white topaz. And the price point is sensational for high quality. And this is unbelievably high quality white topaz. This is your price point. I honestly believe that a strand of white topaz with this amount of clarity, with this amount of purity, which is pretty much 
as eye clean as you can ever expect uh, big quality white topaz to be you know 21.95 is just unbelievable isn't it and it's one of those strands that yeah do you know what a couple of those strands in your stash knowing that you've got that crystal clear quality knowing that you've got that gorgeous quality in your stash you know you've got enough for that bridal boutique you know you've got enough for that prom jewelry what a gorgeous strand of genuine gemstones there beautiful right we've got so much to bring you uh, we're going to move straight on now to a brand new kit everyone which one's my favorite do you want to know how Deb has done this. Do you want to see the rest of the jewelry from this gorgeous kit? You can see it in just a couple of seconds because believe it or not, this has been made using the polymer clay and the glitter from our next kit. It is absolutely amazing, Deb. I love, 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 love this kit. Right, so. You clearly love working with this kit, didn't you, Deb? Yes, I had great fun with this one. Yep. It's stunning, isn't it? It's absolutely it's stunning. Um, be honest. I mean, I know, I know that when you first got this kit home, you looked at it and you thought, ah, how am I gonna, how am I gonna use that glitter and those mm. gemstones together? Because that actually on the board, looking at all these separately, I yeah. can understand. I can understand how you thought that. Yeah, I, I just thought I'm not sure about these colours and. Um, how they work with those glitters and they didn't seem it's almost seemed like two kits had got mixed up together yeah. somehow um, and it wasn't until I actually tipped some of the glitter mm. onto the clay mm. that it clicked and I thought okay that works and it does work let me show you the gemstones first of all beautiful Candy floss pink. Mm. Delicate. Delicate, delicate. Delicate colour. Now, I'm just trying to get my head around this. This is um this is a uh, pink dyed quartz faceted 10 mil rounds. Um you've got a very very soft gentle color here a very a beautiful a, a really beautiful kind of springtime tone here um comparing this to rose quartz it's got a more consistent color it's got a much more consistent color with rose quartz you get lots more zoning of colors lots more areas where the clarity and the color um is is um stronger or weaker um and that necessarily isn't a good or a bad thing it's just it's just a different quality in your gemstones this has got a really consistent color because it's of course a dyed quality of quartz so if you're looking for that consistent quality this is a strand to go for it's beautiful i love it the next strand here is it prey night no it's actually multi-color faceted agate eight mil faceted rounds. Everything from that apple blossom color to an almost howlite white to an almost um, kind of those gorgeous barley sugar colors. You're getting absolutely everything in this strand that you see in those kind of springtime bouquets, in those gorgeous springtime weddings, that really light, fluffy, airy kind of quality. Some of these gemstones are very, very translucent. Some are completely opaque. That's what's so wonderful about the collection of gemstones that you've got here. They, they work together. That springtime quality works, doesn't it? Now, look at this piece of jewelry. It works, doesn't it? How does it work? Why does it work? Okay, this is how it works. You're getting translucent clay in this kit. Translucent clay is exactly as it sounds. It is translucent, so not transparent which would be like looking through a window, not opaque, which is like looking um, at a brick, you know, not, trans, uh, not transparent at all. It is halfway in between, a bit like looking through a stained glass window, almost frosted. Um, using this with any color, with any kind of accent, it's gonna pick up on those accents. The accents you've got in this kit are rose gold plated copper findings, 115 of them. There they all are, meter of chain, S clasps with um, extender chains, head pins, crimp beads, crimp bead covers, earring findings, loads and loads and loads of findings up there. 
rose gold plated copper findings, okay? You're also gonna be getting your beading thread monofilament and elastic in your threading pack. But it's with these accents that Deb has really been able, has really been able to bring this kit to life and bring that polymer clay to life. Silver glitter. Now, I'm always a little bit hesitant as to, op to open these because they do go everywhere. Oh, I love this. It's silvery, but it's got a rainbow glitter quality to it. So it's not just silver glitter you're getting in here. Can you see the blues, greens, reds, silvers? And literally, if I just literally touch my finger on top of the glitter there, you hardly use any. That now is going to be attached to me forever. No, but literally, um, you will, you, you, it, it is, you hardly use any glitter at all with the polymer clay. It is amazing. And it fuses to the polymer clay. Now, I've got this other form of glitter here, which I love. And this is what Deb is using this particular design. This is a gold colored glitter. But instead of just being gold, oh wow, you are getting totally holographic technicolor qualities in here as well because you're going to be getting reds blues greens oranges yellows pinks purples the whole shebang now using these glitters is these glitters are very very different to using child's glitters that you use in crafting they're not kind of big shards of glitter which are very kind of scratchy as soon as you start to use these with the clay and I'll, and, and, and we'll, we'll definitely talk to Deb more about using the glitter in a couple of seconds with the clay as soon as you start to use these with the um, with the clay the clay becomes very silky to touch it becomes really smooth to touch and it doesn't rub off I'm, I'm giving that a good old a good old rub and it's not steady and it's not and it's not coming off at all not coming off on my finger at all you can see that there it's totally smooth it's really really nice and silky now we're going to give you this kit for a really special price today because it, it contains lots of different elements polymer clay glitter gemstones and findings okay today if you were to buy everything separately here from this kit and you were to buy it separately on our website you would be paying 33 pounds uh, sorry, 33 pounds and 15p. 33 pounds and 15p. This, 21 pounds 95p kit was gonna be the price. Because you're getting so many different elements with this kit, you're gonna get it today for under 20 pounds, 19.95. Honestly, oh my goodness me, the amount of clay you're getting here, the length of time these glitters are gonna actually last for, and the gorgeous gemstones, and the, uh, the results that you are gonna get from this kit, 19.95 is way, way, way too low a price. Now, we're gonna go ahead and um, head over to Deb now because you've got to see this kit in jewelry. You've got to see the gemstones with the with the clay with the glitter you've got to see it all together now it does work doesn't it deb this kit just works it seems to just fall together doesn't it it was it was the easiest kit to make up it was so much fun isn't that to awesome do. um and i was really i i felt really upset when it actually came to an end and and i had two little pieces of clay left and i'd used all my beads mm. every single bead um and I, I love it. <laughs> it's I funny because looking at it, it's either. funny because because when Deb first got the kit, you know, you were very honest before the show, and you said, "Do you know what, Carol? When I saw when I saw the strands and I saw the and I saw the um, uh, the clay and I saw the glitter, I thought, how on earth am I gonna, how I, how am I going to make these work together? But look at it. This is and, and Deb, you know, Deb just says, you know, it's it's one of the most enjoyable and one of the easiest kits that she's ever worked with. It's funny mm. how that happens, isn't it? Yeah. It's really funny how that happens. Look at the quality of jewellery that she's been able to make. I love that necklace. I love that kind of fishtail necklace that you've made here. It's so beautiful the way that it curves. Oh, it's just gorgeous. It almost looks like molten metal. But oh, yeah, it's exactly what it looks like. It's, it's um, the, the holographic element of it is amazing because it, lo it looks like um, fish scales and it yeah. looks like... Um, it, it looks like it's got fluidity about it. It's got movement. And it's movement, got movement. Yeah. It's got energy. It's got movement. Beautiful quality. Now look at this piece here. Again, um, uh, Deb has used the polymer clay. Look how it works with the gorgeous findings. Look how it works with those beautiful 
rose gold plated copper findings. It mm. picks out. Um, it does. The glitter kind of um, uh, um, uh, the rose gold findings kind of highlights the 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 reds in the uh, in in the glitter, doesn't it? Yeah. And this yeah. necklace here, I would wear this all day, every day. I love what you've done here. You put the little stars with the um, um, and and set it into the polymer clay. I love that. Yeah, I like that piece mm. as well. It's, um, it would actually go really well with your top today, actually. Yeah. So the silver cute. colours. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. It's. Um, Oh yes, of course you've used a silver, um, the silver uh, colour glitter, glitter with that. On that one. Yeah. yeah, isn't it beautiful? It works so well with the translucent clay. I think if, yeah. it, if, if the translucent clay wasn't in this kit and it was maybe white clay or black clay, it would be a very different story. I think because it's translucent clay with the glitter, it just it, the clay is just the background, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it's just a carrier for the glitter. It's exactly what it is. Yeah, um, stunning, isn't it? But it's glittery, but without it being too childlike. I think it's it's it's, it's a piece of. Um, it's it's a gorgeous kit where every single piece um, you could wear um, whatever your age. It's not too childlike, is it? No. It's really beautiful. It, it can be quite sophisticated looking. Mm, definitely. I mean the the um, the sort of fishtail one on the end mm. is very flamboyant. It very, is very flamboyant. Yeah. Um, but then as you work, work your way down the line, mm. the one at this end, it's it's not shouting quite yeah. as loud. Yeah. Yeah. Um, exactly. It's a lot more subtle the way that you've used it here. Yeah. Now, now, in this pendant here, Deb, you've used, you've got the glitter going through the pendants, but you've put it, you've, I don't know how Pick you've done this. You, you've done it in <laughs> stripes. Can you see that? Can you see how the <laughs> glitter is attached onto the polymer clay in stripes? How do you do that? A pair of tweezers, flake by flake. <laughs> oh. No, 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 no. Oh, I see. A comedian. <laughs> We've got a comedian in our midst, everyone. Sorry. <laughs> no, um, you've used a tool that pretty much everyone's got. If you've yep. got the polymer clay starter pack, um, you're going to have this tool. And it's amazing. This technique is so simple. I don't know. But it's like a little trick, isn't it? Yeah. I'm sure somebody's done it before and I just didn't see it. So when I came up with it, I was really excited. Go on. Fantastic. Um, How do we do this then, Deb? So, actually, i shift that off there. Mm, go for it. I'll just work on the desk. Right, I've got some of the, the clay mm. um, and I've warmed it up. So it's, um, it does take a bit of conditioning, um, the translucent, when you're using it on mm -hmm. its own. So, right, take my roller. Now, when I, when I was at home, I used... How, oh, about, how much no. clay have you got there? Um, it's, it's just about, I suppose it's about the same size as that. I don't know, about a quarter of a block? Yeah, you about know, a quarter of a block. Not yeah. the whole block, a mm. uh, quarter of, half of one of the strips. Yeah, so probably about a sixth, a sixth of yeah. the block, yeah. Yeah, um, but what I did was I made um, a sheet mm -hmm. with the stripes mm -hmm. and then cut the heart pendant. Ah, right, okay. And this pendant out, Lovely. so. Look at this, look at the stripes. Isn't that awesome? I put it um, through my clay roller on number one, but I mean you can you can just roll it out. Mm, okay. So as long as you've got a smooth surface, mm. um, and then right, this is the trick. Take your blade. Ah, your corrugated blade. Kit. Yep. Perfect. You can see it's covered in glitter. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> and then I just pressed it down yeah. onto my sheet and lined it up. Oh, you have as well, yeah. And pressed it down and covered the whole sheet like that. So, oh, it's not yeah. quite lined up, but uh, that gives you the idea. And then you take your glitter. Oh, blimey. Stand Here we back, go. everyone. It's everywhere Don't at home. sneeze. I love it though. It's gorgeous, it. isn't it? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. It is just and gorgeous. And then just using a finger, you can just rub it into the grooves. And the, uh, talk, to, uh, talk to us about how the glitter feels on the clay, because it feels like satin, I think, when well, you start I've, rubbing it in. When I've, I used to do um, creative workshops with children mm. and, um, and their parents. And we used to use a lot of glitter. Mm. Um, and it was, I've actually had pieces of glitter in my fingers, like like a splinter of glitter. Yeah, because um, they're like shards, aren't they? They're not very so nice So sharp. Mm. And this is, is it's, it's like, um, 
if you if you have a fish tank at home you have silver sand in the bottom of the mm. tank and it's a really fine sand that isn't um, isn't mega sharp and it doesn't sort of oh, what are you doing there? cut I'm just polishing it with the blade so oh. it polishes it into the the um, oh, that's the awesome. grooves a bit and it also makes sure that your lines where they're lined up mm. you um, and you get you get rid of some of the join mm -hmm. marks yeah. yeah right so then taking your super flexible blade mm. um, you just slice off your top layer wow oh I love that you wouldn't want to throw those bits of polymer clay away that's no, amazing that's what this piece is it's all these pieces oh then you've got your own glittery clay and I like that it mixes in um, but the more the more you take off um, and the deeper you go the wider your plain stripes are going to be and the finer your glitter stripes will be so it takes a little while just to um, to do that all over your, your clay that looks gorgeous sheet. though can see it starting to yeah that looks awesome I love it <gasps> oh my word that's beautiful and then what I did for the square pendant mm. was I put it back through my clay roller mm. so what that will do is stretch out ah yes your stripes so if I just give that a roll you can see how it will distort the it stripe. does doesn't it that's fantastic. Yeah, could you tilt that up to the um, to the, the camera, camera so we can have yep. a look at that? Oh, look at that. I love it. So that's then how I've made the, the wider stripes on that The square. wider stripes, yes. Um, Isn't that clever? Isn't that clever? Just love that fantastic technique there. Isn't that gorgeous? It's amazing. Yeah, it's really beautiful, and it's just so oh, it's so smooth. It's gorgeous. So, so how long do, how long did you um how long did you bake this pendant for and bake um, the heart shaped pendant for? I left them in the oven while I was having my dinner, so they they were baked for about twenty minutes, half an hour. Okay. Um, but they're quite thin. Mm. That they're, they're only um, I don't know, five mil, mm -hmm. probably maximum, um, in thickness. Mm. So they'd they'd bake. 15 minutes okay fantastic about 125 degrees yeah. C isn't that gorgeous what a fantastic technique and such a different look and it just goes so it just goes to show that sometimes when you get a kit and you look at the gemstones you look at the clay you look at what you've got and you think how am I going to use these and um, all of a sudden they just start working together the kit does the work for you how amazing is that well done <laughs> so under 20 pounds fantastic Thanks for that. Covered in glitter now. I know, oh, yeah. <laughs> I need a shower. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. Right. Oh, here we go. Uh, right, so, pink. Pink, 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 pink. Got your schedule here, Livy. Just on the desk. Oh, thank you. <laughs> right. So we've been bringing you the most incredible deals, haven't we, today, for um, our strands of genuine gemstones, for all of our bundles. We took um, beautiful um, quality gemstones under £20. In fact, we went under, under a tenner, didn't we? Now, I can't promise that we can give you a price slash on this. Well, obviously, we're going to give you a price slash because it's right behind my back, isn't it? Yeah, we're going to give you a price slash on this incredible strand. Now, this is pink colour coated topaz. Beautiful, briolette cut briolette cut pink color coated topaz stunning stunning genuine gemstone strand here the briolette cut is actually a very very difficult cut to achieve um, it is a very wasteful cut only applied to certain gemstones of a certain kind of quality um, just purely because if you can imagine if you cut a gemstone that is um, a big oval or a big kind of bead shape all of the top part of this gemstone is going to be wasted because of course the tapered end of the uh, gemstone is 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 um the part um, around that tapered end is going to be completely useless. So it is a very, very wasteful cut. It's a very skilled cut to achieve. These are all hand faceted, top drilled, pink colour coated topaz. Stunning, hot, hot, hot pink. Now, we're going to give you a fantastic price slash on this. The strand in front of you here, just a couple to make earrings. One would make that feature pendant. 
Stunning strand, isn't it? It should be 19.95 today. So already under 20 pounds. That's the price it should be. Until 9 a.m. tomorrow morning, uh, or until stocks last, we are going lower. We're gonna give you a price slash on this. Give us a call, get involved when you can. This is your deal. It's just amazing, isn't it? Just incredible. £14.95, p the most incredible price point for, for beautiful pink colour coated topaz. Now you might have seen the strand that we bought you earlier on. Very, very similar strands, um, similar in colour. These gemstones that you're going to be getting here are pear drops, these are briolette cut. Um, to put these together, absolutely stunning. If there's any of these ones left, uh, which I think we took to 8.95, uh, then, then by all means come in and get it, 100%, yes. The briolette cut though, so much more difficult to achieve, so much more technically demanding to bring you. And if you missed out for the pink uh, quartz, then why not come in and get uh, pink color coated topaz? You know, arguably more precious uh, than your quartz, not to mention which you've got a briolette cut as well, which is such, a difficult cut to achieve. Um, you're essentially faceting a gemstone as if it was going to be set into jewellery as well, but the Briolette cut is a very three-dimensional faceted gemstone that you're going to be getting here. 0800 644 655, a stunning strand of genuine gemstones there for under 15 pounds, well done. Now, I've got a bundle to bring you now, which literally blink, blink, and you're gonna miss it, okay? It's one of those deals, blink and you're gonna miss it. A bit like the DVD that we bought you yesterday. Blink and you're going to miss it. Blink and it's going to have sold out. We've undernarred over this bundle a lot this morning. Kim and I have been, uh, had a rather heated discussion about how low we could go with this bundle today. Kim said one price. I said another price. Let's see who's right, shall we? Um, this is going to go. To say this is going to go low, Okay, to say this is going to go low is the understatement of the year. I cannot guarantee you are ever going to see emerald, which is my favourite gemstone, and my birthstone. May's birthstone! Yeah! Is it May the 1st today? Yeah. It is, yeah. 1st of May. Fantastic. It's emerald. It's, it's, um, it's emerald's uh, birthstone, May's birthstone. Uh, my favourite gemstone. I cannot guarantee you are ever going to see emeralds going down to this price again, which is why I haven't put the graphics on screen yet, because I want everyone to have a fair enough chance. You've got to be on the phone lines now. It's a free phone number from a BTN online. Be prepared on the web because this is going to go like that. It really honestly is. I can't guarantee you are ever going to see emerald on Jewelry Maker again going down to such a low price. Okay, double strand of emerald here. Can, you, can we double check where this emerald is from, please, Levy? A double strand of emerald here. Oh my goodness me, it's Brazilian emerald. Right, uh, okay. Brazilian emeralds. Brazil, responsible for some of the world's most exquisite emerald. Talking about Itibera, Santa Teresina, which no longer produces any emerald because uh, resources are just so depleted. This double trouble double strand so actually you're pretty much going to be getting four strands of emerald here because you're getting close to a double you're getting a double strand here which is close to 80 90 centimeters of just nothing but emerald felicity and sussex you've come in to get two the phone lines have gone absolutely berserk loads of people on the web have already come in to get this and secure this for themselves blink and you're gonna miss it today you're not just going to get a double strand of emerald you are going to get two double strands of emerald two double strands of emerald that is the equivalent to four strands of emerald today what would be a fair enough price for you what, what would be a fair enough price for the equivalent to four strands of emerald or two double strands of emerald what would be a great price for you under 30 pounds under 25 pounds surely surely not under 20 pounds under 15 we can't do that. You're right. Today, we can't do that. The equivalent of four strands of emerald. I can't guarantee you are ever going to see emerald going down to such a low price ever again on Jewelry Maker. If you do, you get it. But honestly, I cannot guarantee you're ever going to see that again. I honestly think this could be a once in a lifetime opportunity. 
I rest my case. Emerald. Emerald. Two double strands of emerald for £7.50. Oh <laughs> my word. The phone lines, the web have gone absolutely... We're going into meltdown. There's 80 chances left. A, a, a quantity bar. There's no, there's no point even showing you the quantity that we had or, or had um, because, because it's not even loading because our quantity bar cannot keep up with the amount of you on the phone lines. We started off with how many? 150. How many have we got now? We've got about 40 left. It's just abs It is bonkers, bonkers, bonkers. Right, we're going to go over to the Wall of Fame. We're going to see what the Wall of Fame. If you've if you're coming to get this on our website and you haven't checked out your basket, do it now. Otherwise, it will be taken out your basket and given to somebody else because this will sell out within the next few seconds. Okay, we'll see you over the Wall of Fame. Keep coming in through for this. If you want it, you're going to have to be ever so quick because a load of you are multi buying at the minute. Do check your baskets out as quickly as you can. Um, we want to know your freaky food combinations as well, please. So do keep on texting in. We'd love to hear from you today. Uh, text number 60777, text to charge at your standard network rate. Do send us your text in. The weirder the better, because it's really freaking Kim out and it's really funny. Uh, so weird food combinations. Uh, is it stranger than Brussels sprout omelets? No, no, that's just a lie. Christmas pudding with bacon and eggs. Pickled onion and strawberry jam. Apparently those are some of our texts. I actually don't believe you. I want to have a, I want to see a video of you eating it. I'm joking. Uh, but fantastic. We'll see you over the Wall of Fame. Keep sending a text in. We'll see you there in a second. I've got number 133 here. This is absolutely beautiful. Sent in by, oh, now, am I going to pronounce your name right? Oh, goodness me, I hope so. Uh, Sucre, Sucre, I think. Sucre Kalkan? I think that's your name. I'm so sorry if I've pronounced it incorrectly. I hope I've said it right. Uh, he says, hello, everyone. My mum has purchased a scoop of gems uh, from Jewelry Maker for me. Using only the gems from this scoop and antique bronze plated copper findings and silver flash plated copper beads um, from Jewelry Maker, I've made a three strand necklace. I've decided to call this piece Jungle Fever due to the colours. Um, hope you like it and uh, this is my first attempt on working with genuine gemstones. Do you know what? That is absolutely stunning and Asukri has made that from a bead scoop that she got from Jewelry Maker. It just shows it. That is an absolutely stunning piece of jewellery. You should be mm. really, really pleased with that. Awesome. Best of luck to you, my darling. You're number 133. Okay, this is from Shilpa in Cardiff. Um, and it says uh, that the, the wire wrapped Labradorite cabochons. Thanks, JM, for introducing me to this amazing stone. These cabochons truly bring out its beauty. They make you wonder at the awesome power. Of, I'm not making this up this time. They make you. Um, wonder at the awesome power of Mother Nature mm. in creating these precious stones. Um, the picture does not do any justice to them. You have to see them in real life to believe in them. I can't stop eulogising. <laughs> Is that right? Have I said that right? Yeah. The beer quartz really. Briolette. Briolette yeah. and the wire is also from JM. I think I might have to wear my glasses. Oh, sorry, right, darling. <laughs> Thank you once again and the very best to the team in JM. Sure, but they are Shilpa. absolutely beautiful pennants you've made there. They're stunning, aren't they? They are amazing. Clever, One, clever three, lady. Uh, number 135 here. This is really, really beautiful. So much wire work, so many connectors here. This is just beautiful. Uh, sent in by. Uh, it doesn't say. Ow! Oh. It doesn't say. Um, Sam? 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 Is it Sam? Oh, I think it might be Sam. Una. 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 Oh, hi, Una. It says, hi, Ola Joey Maker. A little bit of sunshine is just what we needed to get back into the swing of making again. Uh, this piece I've made for the wall uh, has been made with golden, yellow, and purple fluorite and a combination of mixed wires. I hope you like it. That's absolutely gorgeous. And best of luck to you. Best of luck to you, uh, um, Una. Gorgeous. Um, this is uh, number 136 and it's Sarah Hood who sent this one in. Hello to all you crazy people at JM Towers. Nice. This is my latest photo for WAF. It's made entirely from JM products, of which I now have a bigger stash than your warehouse. <laughs> <laughs> this set is being worn by one of the models at a charity fashion show. Oh, wow. Uh, 
um, in our local town on Thursday the 1st of May. Today, West Houghton, tomorrow Paris, London and New <laughs> York. <laughs> Lol. Keep up the good work. Regards, Sarah from West Houghton. Oh, good luck with the fashion show, Sarah. Mm. That sounds awesome. Yeah. Gorgeous and stunning pieces of jewellery there. Number 137, really lovely. I want to know what these stones are here because these are really unusual yeah. shapes. Uh, from Kath in Gloucester. Hi, jewellery maker. This is meant to be for this week's Wall of Fame. I've made red, oh, it's coral. Re a red coral and yellow agate bracelet. All gems and findings are from jewellery maker. I wanted to make something that reminds us of summer. Love the show. Good luck to everyone. Kath in Gloucester. That's gorgeous, Kath, and stunning colours for summertime. Mm. Right, um, now, um, still coming up on today's show, have a look at all this. Oh, my goodness me. Oh yeah, we've also got gorgeous genuine sapphire coming up on today's show at midday, which is just stunning. And if you want to come on any of our workshops, or um, is it a workshop? Oh, I do beg your pardon. Um, if you want to learn how to uh, refine any of your skills, uh, you can uh, have a look at our web tutorials and here's how to get involved with that. You can now watch clips from Jewelry Maker on our YouTube channel. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. Do you need a helping hand to get started with Jewelry Maker? Are you stuck for ideas and need inspiration? Then visit our Jewelry Maker website where you can find our video tutorials. Expand your knowledge and skills with these easy to follow jewelry making demonstrations. Whether you're a beginner, hobbyist or business owner, there's always something new to learn. It couldn't be easier. Simply click and learn some new jewelry making techniques. You can now keep in touch by liking Jewelry Maker UK on Facebook. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. If you miss a Jewelry Maker show, then simply go to our YouTube page where you'll be able to find hours of Jewelry Maker footage. Search by show, date or type. Alternatively, search by guest designer by using our playlist page. You can also find hours of tutorials with handy hints and tips to give you inspiration. Our YouTube page is updated on a daily basis so you can access any show at any time. Stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can now keep in touch by following Jewelry Maker on Twitter. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. We are back, we are back. Oh my goodness me, we got the most amazing finding seal. Yeah. It's absolutely so. Do you want to see it? It really is stunning. Um, how do you fancy a hundred findings? Sounds good, doesn't it? How do you fancy 200 findings? How do you fancy 500 findings? Not enough? Okay. How do you fancy 1,000 findings? How do you fancy 1,200 findings? What, you want twice as much as that? Okay. How about 2,400 findings? Yeah. Yeah. 2,400 findings. That is more findings than you can shake a stick at. Yeah. Now, all of this is one deal today, okay? All of this is one great deal. I wanna show you what you're gonna be getting. Okay, let's talk about these jump rings. 
This is all yellow gold plated copper, okay? So just to make you aware, yellow gold plated copper, so precious metal plated copper. You're gonna be getting a whole load of these jump rings, okay? So, um, open jump rings, you're gonna be getting 200 yellow gold plated copper open five mil jump rings. Um, jump rings, right, what are you gonna use your jump rings for? Well, because they're open jump rings, you can use them for anything um, from making your own chain to kind of stacking them together, making them into little spacer beads. Um, Deb, if you've got loads and loads and loads of jump rings, what, what, or, or, or if you want to do a project that primarily focuses on jump rings, um, what would that project be? What, what would it be? Would it be chain? Yeah, I like using um, earrings and, and connecting uh, like multiples. It's like the simplest chain mail ever. Right. But two jump rings one way, two the other way and two back so you've got six all together yeah and made like a double chain going down oh nice and idea. it's really pretty yeah i bet um, but it's dead easy to do and so. do you know what because you've got 200 jump rings as part of this deal you could probably make dozens and dozens of those isn't that fantastic? Um, 200 jump rings in total. I like the idea of kind of stacking them together and making them into little, um, making them into little um, uh, uh, spacer uh, mm. beads as well. I think they're really, really fantastic. They look, they look like a little uh, gizmo coil. Uh, so you've got 200 of your jump rings. If you're freaked out about what to use findings for, always go to our Facebook page. There's over 26,000 people who uh, like our Facebook page, or you can uh, get our uh, jewelry maker, uh, get started with jewelry maker magazine out, uh, which you get free with your first order, with uh, loads of inspiration there about how you can use your findings. You're also going to be getting all of these. I haven't even got all these out. In fact, let's get them all out. Let's have a look at these. Look at all of these. Yeah. You are going to be getting extender chains with ribbon ends and an S clasp. You are going to be getting eight of these. How incredible is that? Eight, is that say eight or six? Eight, yeah. Eight extender chains with ribbon ends and S clasps. Eight of these. That's pretty incredible, isn't it? Yeah? Wow. Okay, next. Let's show you the toggle clasps. Oh, I can't believe you get so many toggle clasps as part of this findings pack. It's amazing. Let's just get one of these out. Again, yellow gold plated uh, copper. Here they are. Toggle clasp, or T bar clasp, you might know it as. Your toggle clasps, you are going to be getting 30 of these. 30 toggle clasps. 30. 30 necklaces, 30 bracelets, 15 sets of cufflinks if you want. 30 of these toggle clasps, yellow gold plated copper, don't forget. Isn't that amazing? Okay, next box. Next box, here we go, earring findings. Now these are shepherd's hook earring findings. Again, yellow gold plated copper. Here we go, I'll just pick one of them up so you can have a look at them there. Really fantastic finding here. You're going to be getting 60 shepherd took earring finding so that's 30 pairs in total 30 pairs in total fantastic chain yeah you got chain in this as well have a look at all of this oh my word oh my goodness me look at all of this chain look at all this it's all on look at that it's just everywhere You are going to be getting, oh my goodness me, one, two, three meters of chain. Three meters of chain. Do you know what? I, have we got enough people in the studio to kind of see how many meters, how, <laughs> how, how long that actually is? Can I hold one of these? And then we need, maybe Deb could get the last one or something. Claire, do you want to get one of these? Why not? Yeah? Mm -hmm. One meter. One meter. So Deb, if you could take the end of that one there. That one. There. Yep. Okay. And then get the end of the other one. There we go. And we're spread out. There we go. Okay, so, and then that's it and then Claire are you gonna that's it there we go Claire's gonna come over now 
There we go. Side. Claire, yeah, that side there. <laughs> okay, so there we go. That is, that's your chain. That's your chain. <laughs> I mean, that's a lot of chain, yeah? Yeah. Thanks, guys. <laughs> that is three, what, it says three metres of chain. I think that's even more, actually, than three metres of chain. I think we're being very conservative saying three metres of chain. Um, so a load of chain. And then, oh, my goodness, you're not going to be able to believe this. And then two... 1,100, I'd like to count these please, Amelia. 2,000, I'm joking. 2,100 yellow gold plated copper spacer beads. Oh my word. 2,100 yellow gold plated copper spacer beads. That is outstanding. Standing. Now, let's face it, that's a lot of chain, that's an awful lot of space of beads. 30 pairs of earring findings, 30 toggle clasps, 8 extender chains, and 200 jump rings. 2,400 findings is a lot of findings, yeah? You will end up using them. Once these are gone, they are gone, okay? A lot of you have been multi-buying, which is brilliant to see. You will end up using these. I know it seems like a lot of findings. It is a lot of findings, but you, oh, look at all those. You will end up using them. Even if you're brand new to jewelry making, you're thinking, goodness me, that's a lot of finding. Yeah, it is. You will end up using them though. Your price for this yellow gold plated mega findings pack with 2,400 findings. It might be the last time you ever get to see this. Do you want to see your price today? You're not going to be able to believe this. That's less than a penny each. $39.95 for 2,400 findings. Oh my word. The web, the phone light, the web, the, the phone lines are jam-packed at the minute. There is a bit of a queue. Um, if you're sitting in a bit of a queue at the minute, please do be patient. Sylvia from Surrey is coming to get three. Um, um, uh, well done to you. Karen from Perthshire is coming to get two. Mary from Lancashire is coming to get two. Jean from Lancashire. Oh, both from Lancashire is coming to get two as well. This is just tremendous, isn't it? Well done. What a fantastic deal. Deb, there's 2,400 findings here. That's a lot of findings. You're gonna, it is. But, but you will end up using them, won't you? You'll use them quicker than you realise. Yeah. Because, um, and also, if you are new, it's brilliant to get that because um, you, you need to experiment with different types of findings. You do, yes. And it can cost you so much if you have to buy the huge, great packets or if you have to buy the tiny like twos it and It can threes. be quite an expensive mistake to make. It can. Mm. So there, you've got a whole range that you can play around with, test out, see how they work. And then, but then, you know, if, you're, if you've been making jewellery for a while, mm. um, again, you've got a nice stash there. Yeah. You've got yeah. a lot to play it's, with. It's a, similar, it's a similar kind of thinking behind uh, the 100 metre spools of wire that Gemma Crow says, who's one of our guest designers, who says, do you know what, having 100 metres of wire on a, on, a, on a reel rather than 10 metres of wire gives you so much more to play with. Yes. And by the end of working with that 100 metre spool of wire, you will, you will know exactly what you're doing with wire. The same can be said for these findings. Once you come to the end of this findings pack with 204, uh, sorry, 2,400 findings in it, you will know exactly what to do and probably have found some really interesting ways to use the, the jump rings, the uh, extender chains, the uh, to 30 toggle class. My goodness me. The... Um, the uh, earring findings, the chain, and of course these beautiful decadent spacer beads. I just love them. And do you know what, with the spacer beads, because you're getting so many of them, I would be tempted uh, just to make um, a really beautiful, um, just, uh, just a single, a, a single, a single simple um, strand uh, bracelet, just using mm. uh, some of the spacer beads, just using uh, one lot of the spacer beads, just on some monofilament or something. Yeah, that'd be really pretty. Wouldn't it just? 
wouldn't it? Just, just getting some monofilament, because you get 2,100 of the spacer beads, you may as well do something really outlandish with them. Um, getting some monofilament, just threading uh, these onto a load and load of uh, monofilament. You might, you might need your glasses because they are really, really petite and beautiful. And just wearing a couple of really gorgeous stretchy or, 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 or simple uh, single strand uh, bracelets using some of these um, space beads, they're, they're just gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Being able to dot these sporadically into your pieces is just, it's just absolutely gorgeous. 40 pounds, 40 pounds for 2,400 findings. Amazing, less than 50 chances available now, well done. Well done. Now, oh yes please, I'd like to see the couple of texts. Got a couple of texts in apparently. <laughs> Do I actually want to see these Ooh. or not? Are these pretty grim uh, food combinations. Uh, from Laura in Greater Manchester. Hi to all the jewelry maker. My son loves what's it and ketchup sandwiches. <laughs> <laughs> that would be like, that would be like cheese and ketchup, wouldn't it? Because what's it's like cheese, aren't they? Wouldn't they go I'd, soggy? I'd, 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 I'd go for that. They'd go soggy. Probably would do, wouldn't they? I'd go for it mm. though. Would you go for it, Claire? Cheese and tomato. Like Cheese and tomato, yeah, exactly. There you go. Uh, Jackie from Western Bartonshire says, uh, hi, Carol and uh, all. Hi there. Um, I'm loving the show as always. Good. I love toast and cheese. That sounds good. Mm -hmm. Dipped in tomato soup. Oh, Chris oh. dips into a pot noodles. Oh. I've never tried that, but I've tried cheese on toast with tomato soup and it is amazing. <laughs> the last two nights I've had soup for my dinner and, uh, and with my soup I've had cheese on toast. It is the ab cheese on toast I could eat till it's coming out of my ears. Yeah. I absolutely love cheese on toast. I don't know what it is about cheese on toast. Got a bit, a bit of Worcestershire sauce on there as well. Don't complicate things by putting ham and stuff like that. Just, just, just cheese on toast. <laughs> it's got to be really great cheese. Uh, Joe from the West Midlands. Uh, mummy, what? Mummy, yeah, fried crisp. What? No. No, 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 no. Fried Christmas pudding with bacon and eggs. It's great when you dunk the Christmas pudding in the runny egg yolk. Joe, I honestly think you might, that's just wrong. crazy. <laughs> no. Don't you are that. bonkers. Apparently, Lynn from Bristol knows somebody who likes strawberry jam and piccalilli sandwiches. Now that's a lie. That has got to be a lie. Do you know what I tried for the first time um, earlier on this year, and I wish I'd tried it years ago because I absolutely love it. Haggis. It's Ooh. delicious. It's so delicious. Oh my goodness me, it's so beautiful. Have you tried it? No. I'm no. not going to, no. Oh, it's gorgeous. <laughs> You've got barley in it. Um, it. It's absolutely delicious and it's spicy. It's, oh, it's absolutely beautiful. Have you tried haggis? Has anyone else here tried haggis? Veggie haggis. Veggie haggis, and Amelia's tried. There are meat eaters out there who prefer the veggie haggis. Ah. Really? That's interesting. Ah. So what do they, what do they put the haggis in then? A vegetarian stomach. There you go. <laughs> Rather than a sheep stomach, it's a vegetarian stomach. <laughs> right. Kit. Oh, one step looper. Oh, fantastic. Yeah, tool. One step looper. One step looper. Have you used this one before, Deb? Have you used a one step looper? No, I haven't. One step looper, one step looper, one step looper. I do it the long hand way. We've actually got a little demo on how to use this. It is the most awesome, awesome tool. Um, you can make your own eye pins. The great thing about the one step looper though, oh, there we go. There you are. Uh, so the great thing about the one step looper is you can make your own, jump, uh, sorry, your own um, eye pins. You can make them as long as you want, as short as you want out of any colour wire that you want, out of pretty much any gauge wire, out of pretty much any gauge wire that you want. You literally feed your wire in. There you go, getting it nice and still. The reason why it's taking a little bit longer is because there's a voiceover with it. Uh, you then close the one step looper. There's your off cut, just uh, being cut off there. There you go. Uh, 
that gone. Open the pliers. There we go. There's your eye pin. Done. So simple, so easy. Um, and it is literally just one step. If you do make your own eye pins using round nose pliers, you've got your wire. You have to make your eye pin like that. Um, and if uh, that kind of movement, that kind of um, turning movement, when you make your um, um, uh, when you make your eye pin, puts a lot of pressure on your wrist. And if you do mm -hmm. have arthritis, if you do suffer with arthritis in your in your wrists, um, then then you'll know just how difficult that kind of movement can be, and how painful it can be as well. Um, with your one step looper, you literally just feed your wire in. Boom. And they're really nice, comfortable handles as well. So even if you do have um, slight dexterity issues in your hands, um, they'll be nice and comfy to use as well. They've got like a, almost like a comfort grip on them. So you literally just feed your wire um, through the hole. There you go. That's it. Close it shut. And there is your eye pin. It's done. It's really, really simple. Now, like I say, with your... Uh, with your one-step loopers, you can um, you can make your eye pins as long as you like, as short as you like, um, and use pretty much any gauge wire that you like and any colour wire that you like as well. It's such a simple and easy tool to use. Here it is again. Feed your wire in. There you go. And pointing, lots of pointing. There you go. Pointing, and some <laughs> and a thumb in shot, and some more pointing, and a bit more pointing, <laughs> and then a bit more. Is she actually going to make it? Tap. Come on. That was a double tap. A, a, a bit of a double tap. A bit, very technical yeah, term. Technical. There you go. Squeeze it closed, and there's your eye pin. And then, it, and then you open up the pliers again, and take it out. Do you want to see your price? Here's your deal today. Twenty-four ninety-five for your one-step pliers. It's a great deal, isn't it? Is that your deal today? No. We're going to go lower. Yeah. Why? Because we can. We're going to honour the last pre, uh, the previous price slashing price. Under twenty pounds. 18 pounds, isn't that fantastic? Well done, great, great, great tool here for you. One step looper, not to mention which it comes with instructions on the back as well. Comes with your instructions on the back. You can always go to our YouTube channel and find out and, and, and watch that technique, watch that tutorial on how to use the one step pliers, um, sorry, the one step looper. Um, so a really, really fantastic tool to use, time saving and energy saving as well. Um, and it also means that you're gonna be wasting less wire as well if you do find that you are given um, head pins and, uh, sorry, given eye pins and they're always gonna be way, way, way too long. It's gonna cut down on the amount that you actually uh, uh, throw away, the amount that you actually waste really really fantastic there one step loopers there for 18 pounds well done right next i've got another tool i've got another tool i've got another tool i do you got another tool i do so this one is i'm going to pop that there this is one of our most popular tools at the minute uh, we bought it to you on the show yesterday and people went absolutely bananas for it it is just gorgeous it is our knotting tool um, lots and lots and lots of you um, um, not, uh, sorry, uh, make your own pearl pieces of jewellery. When you buy pearl jewellery on the uh, high street, um, whether it's antique, whether it's brand new, quite often what you will find is uh, in between each one of the gemstones, in, in, in between each one of the pearls, um, there will be a knot in the thread, in the silk thread and the strand. That is so if the necklace should break, you're only ever gonna lose one of the gemstones. Um, and not to mention which, it helps to separate out the gemstones so as much light as possible gets to those beautiful pearls. This is such a simple, easy tool to use. When we bought it to you yesterday, loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of these went. And this is how you use it. You simply take off the end stopper, like that. There you go. It's very sharp. Don't do that. It's very sharp. There we go. Pointing. Some more pointing. If you go to our YouTube channel, you can see this with the, um, with the, um, uh, the voiceover. It's a little bit clearer as to why the clip is that little bit longer. Is it my voiceover? Oh, is it? A true professional doing the voiceover for this, by the way. <laughs> so you tie your knot, because to get your knots really, really close to your gemstones on necklaces and bracelets is almost impossible to do by hand. If you want to get it right up to the gemstone, you need your knotting tool. Okay, so you put your knot over the prong, get it really close up to the gemstone, pull it really nice and tight through that kind of forked area, put it really nice and tight, and then you lift up the lever. There you go. She's gonna do it. She's gonna do it any minute now. Ah, ah, come on, Anna, pull! <laughs> Boing, there you go, and it's done. There you go, right. 
What on earth these clips take that long? So it's because of the voiceover, because they're being nice and clear. So here we go. So great price for you. Um, hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of these have gone over the last few months. And in my opinion, because we do do a number of different knotting tools here at Jewelry Maker, in my opinion, this is the best one. In my opinion, this, this is the one that I, I uh, would use. I, I think it's really, really simple. It, it works every time. Um, and this is your price point for it. It's another great reason because it is so unbelievably cheap. £8.95p for your knotting tool. Really, really awesome price. And um, like I said, to try and do this by hand, to try and not, uh, to try and get a knot in a strand really close to a genuine gemstone is almost impossible because of course your fingers are a certain width and it's really difficult to get the knot all the way up the thread. Um, to do it with this though, uh, the, the prong kind of acting as your finger. Um, it is it is really, really simple. So, so easy to use. And it feels really nice, this tool as well. It feels really sturdy, great quality. Absolutely wonderful, well done. Um, we've got a review for this one as well on uh, FIFO. FIFO, just want a knee for my pearl necklace. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Have you used this one uh, before, uh, Deb? Yeah, that's the one I've got. Good tool, home. isn't it? Yeah, I like it because you can carry it around with you as well. Um, it's not hefty. It's yeah, some of the knotting some of them tools are, a bit more uh, are quite big, aren't they? Mm. The kind of the board size ones. And um, this yeah. literally you can pop it in your um pop it in your toolkit and it's and it's just ready to go pop in your handbag. You look a bit stranger if you if everything falls out your handbag and this falls out. Yeah. What on earth is that? If you're not a jewelry maker, you're probably not going to know what it is. Uh, but yeah, uh, uh, just be careful though, because a stopper might come off in your bag. You know, do be careful because it is very very sharp. That little needle on the end. Um, we've had a text in. Love uh, the love the knotting tool. Uh, once I got the hang of it, very easy to use. Kiss Mary in Mansfield. Thanks a lot for that, Mary, and a big kiss back to you as well. Uh, but it is a really, really simple, easy tool to use. And eight eight ninety five. It's one of those tools that you just think, do you know what? Yeah, I'm just going to buy that. Think about it. If you bake loads of cakes, if you if you're a big um, if you're big into your cooking, you probably spend eight ninety five on what a uh, on on a set of really awesome, um, really precise measuring cups and maybe an awesome chopping board or something like that. You know, these are uh, we want this to be a staple, an absolute essential for you for under nine pounds. Fantastic tool there, really simple and easy to use, and you also for under. <laughs> A tenor. Why is Jenny Cleary behind the presenters, uh, behind the designer desk, on her hands and knees? There. I don't even want to know. <laughs> Jenny Cleary, I don't even want to know what you're doing behind there. Hello, darling. Hello, are you all right? <laughs> I'm stealing, I'm borrowing chain for my gangster rap birthday message. You're borrowing chain for your gangster rap um, birthday message. Uh-huh. In a job ring is where I spend most of my days, chilling and maxing, relaxing. I think the, 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 the secret with Jenny Cleary is never ask what she's doing. Never ask what she's thinking. Never ask where she's been. I had to dig through. There aren't that many others in There's there, really. There's a lack of chain in here. There is. I think she doesn't even need a mic, does she? That gun metal one was the only one. Mother's meeting going on over there. Anyway. Born with an internal microphone. Born with an internal microphone. Right, I said! Right! Okay, uh, we're going to do the smoking quarters. Right, okay, here we go. Tell you what, the, Ooh, birth yes. the birthday show is going to be an absolute, it's going to be ridiculous. <laughs> Have you got some? <laughs> I Sounds absolutely. like Christmas. <laughs> Sounds you do like sound like Christmas. Santa Claus. I absolutely love Jenny Cleary, but I tell you what, mad as a box of frogs. Even by my standards, she's absolutely bonkers. And she's like that in real life. When the cameras go off, she's exactly the same. In fact, I think she's probably worse. <laughs> this is the t she's look, look, she just left her shoes over there. Oh yeah. She just left her shoes, just abandons items of her clothing. <laughs> Your shoes. Just left her shoes on the floor. <laughs> They won't fit me either. I've got huge I can't feet, so. even, I just, Jenny Cleary is special. My gangster Yes, you are, love. Get out. Go on. Love you, bye. Love you too. <laughs> She's gorgeous, isn't she? I love her. Uh, right, smoky quartz. Now, um, do you know, I said before the show today, uh, uh, I think I've actually mentioned this on the live show today, Kim. Could you just, is this going where I think it's going? Yeah, right. Um, you know that emerald bundle we had um, a few moments ago? You know how quickly that emerald bundle went? 
Yeah. I think the same could be said for this strand of smoky quartz. Do you want to see it? Smoky quartz. This coated smoky quartz strand is absolutely beautiful. It's got a beautiful silvery edge to it. I just love it. Say again, darling. Sorry, Kim, did you say something to me? The most beautiful strand of smoky quartz here. Smoky quartz is one of those gemstones that you can wear with anything. You can put with anything. It is a totally universal gemstone. It will go with every single one of the kits, every single one of the bundles. It will go with absolutely everything that we bring you on Jewelry Maker. It's softer than black. It's obviously a lot darker than white. If you want to mix it with other colors, it can be a lot less intense than mixing, uh, i.e. black and white. Uh, white and brown is a lot softer on the eye. Pink and, um, pink and uh, brown, very, very soft on the eye, whereas pink and black, very, very uh, dramatic. It's soft, it's elegant, and oh my goodness me, it's coated. Now, this is a big, big strand. There are some big, chunky gemstones here. Um, three, six, nine, there's about 10 on a strand. Deb, this is a pretty special strand of coated smoky quartz. How would you use these? I love this. Do you like it, by the way? I think it's absolutely gorgeous. Isn't this stunning? It is. It's amazing. And the colours within it, you, you sort of... It's got almost like um, a smoky quality mm. to the smoky quartz. Absolutely, but like yeah. A, yeah. Um, it's a silver grey over the tone of the brown. It's beautiful, isn't it? Which yeah. is incredible. Yeah. It just looks amazing. Yeah. Um, so... I do my usual trick of having to have a look at it. I'll have so many bracelets at my wrist because mm. every strand that I fall in love with, I want to make into a bracelet or a ring. Is that so you can look at the piece so of jewellery? So I can see it. Yeah, yeah. Mm. See, that's it, isn't it? When you wear um, earrings, when you make earrings, when you make necklaces and pendants, quite often you don't get to see that piece of jewellery as much as you'd like to, whereas if you make it into a ring or a bracelet, you get to see it all the time. Um, this is a really special trend of smoky quartz. For me, you know, we've had those strands today on today's show that have been absolutely ridiculous price points and you have an idea about where you think this should be, the kind of price point that you think it should be. Looking at this strand, what would be your price point? For me, my price point for this show, at the very, very lowest, I would say 1995. I'd say 1995, mm -hmm. that should be as low as we go. We are going ridiculously lower than that absolutely unbelievably lower than that today 1995 you couldn't get further it is so far away from that price point it's unbelievable i think there's been a mistake in the pricing of this round i honestly do because there is no way on earth i would ever put a price point on this smoky quartz of this What? I know. 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 No way. Seven ninety-five. You're getting ten on this strand. Seven ninety-five. That's what. That's less than eighty p each. It is absolutely ridiculous, isn't it? Each one of these could be that statement ring, couldn't it? Statement ring. Do you know what, that one there, what, any of them? Statement ring with a bit of wire. Oh my goodness me. Even if you sold that ring for a pound, even if you sold that ring for a pound, there's another nine genuine gems there and you've, and you've easily made your money back. You're never gonna sell that ring though for a pound, are you? It's gonna be, it's, it's easily gonna be eight, 10, 12 pounds. You know, what a stunning strand of genuine gemstones. Uh, do with it what you will, but I have to say, smoky quartz of this kind of colour, this kind of quality. Mm, that's stunning. Seventeen ninety five, I think, would have been too. Uh, would have been a bit more like it, but you know, even yeah. even at seventeen ninety five, I think it would have been too much of a low price. Seven ninety five is just ridiculous. Angie from London's coming to get four strands of these. Well done, you, my love. Elizabeth from North Yorkshire is coming to get two. If you do want to multi buy, please just go for it, because honestly. 
smoky quartz of this kind of quality for that kind of price is absolutely ridiculous. But a text in from Mary, who's from Yorkshire, who says, hi, Carol, good to see you. Even after all this time, I get shocked at the low prices for excellent quality jewelry. Uh, and that's Mirabelle. Oh, hi, Mirabelle, how you doing, Levy? Oh, great to hear from you, darling. Mwah. Um, so fantastic, 7.95 for your gorgeous coated smoky quartz. It truly is absolutely astonishing how low this is. Anna from Greater Manchester, you've been at multi buying as well. That's great to see. It really is amazing, isn't it? What a treat for every single one of you watching today. And it is one of those strands that you look at and you think, has there been a mistake? Mm. Has there been a mistake made by pricing this incredible strand at that? I mean, it, it's just, it, it's way That's, too low, isn't it, Deb? It is. I'd buy probably two or three of those. Not to mention, which we, we haven't seen smoky quartz for ages on jewelry, no. have we? And the size of them, they're, yeah. not, they're not little chips. No, or, they're not little piddly gemstones. These know. are big. These are big. They'd look amazing with labradorite because of the, oh, um, the colour yeah. on them. Definitely. They'd look absolutely amazing. Definitely. Um, Ishbel from uh, Inverclyde, you've come in to get two of these. That's it's just fantastic. Well done. So is Anna from Greater Manchester. I'm absolutely over the moon for you today. I'm so pleased we can bring you smoky quartz like this for such an amazing price point. £7.95p. What a treat. Well done. Right, we've got the final kit now. Ooh. I don't even want to know what they're doing in there. They've got a bag on their head. Can we can we bring up the workshop room live? They're they're, they're filming a birthday <laughs> message. They have got organza bags on their heads. Um, this is in preparation. This is in preparation for the birthday show, which is on Sunday. I don't even want to know what they're doing. That's Chloe in there. Danny, who is uh, who is, is Jenny's Claire? producer, is there? Jenny and uh, and uh, Kaz. That is seriously special, isn't it? Oh, and Claire. Claire, yeah. Who's the boy? Danny. Danny, producer Danny. Crouch, crouch, down. crouch down. Oh, that'll be Lee, who's probably who's probably in charge of filming it. I don't know. I don't even want to know. <laughs> I don't want to know what they're doing. But anyway, it's for the birthday show, which is this Sunday. This Sunday, Jewelry Maker turns four, and we've got the most amazing show lined up for you on Sunday. I think pretty much all the guest designers are going to be in, pretty much all the presenters are going to be in. My little baby is going to be coming in, hopefully. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed if I can bring her in. If I can, I will. Aww. She's going to love it. <laughs> so much to eat, so many places to crawl. Although she's not crawling, she's shuffling. She's merely shuffling. Do you know what? I did something really naughty last night that I shouldn't have done. You know, oh, I tell you what, it's so naughty. Well, it's not really <laughs> naughty. Well, no, maybe it is. Um, um, I gave her a milk um, before bed. She has a big, a big bottle of milk, which she absolutely loves, and just lies there, just going, Bap, and just loving it, and just going into a, a milk coma, because they just kind of get drunk on milk. Um, and Well, no, they do. <laughs> Babies get drunk on milk. They do, they just lie there, just going, ah, ah. Um, And I picked her up, and instead of putting her in her cot, I held her, and she slept on me for like 10, 15 minutes. I don't think I've ever oh. done that before. And I just, oh, I just lay with her, just loving her, and just listen to her snoring. She's so, oh, she's just beautiful, I love her. And they'll put her in her cool. No, but I, I don't know, people say, you shouldn't let babies get used to doing that. And then, oh, I don't know. I'm slow with it. No. 15 minutes, it was gorgeous. Just lay there. Fine. In a little room. Smell of babies and a bit of sick. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely. I love her, I love her. <laughs> and hopefully I'll get to bring her on Sunday, which would be great for the birthday show. Right, last <laughs> kit, last kit. Leaves. What? Whoa! Leaves of grass? Leaves of grass? If I'd known that, I'd have made something different. <laughs> Where did that name come Who from? Who put this kit together? <laughs> Becky. If you're watching, Becky. Nice kit. What's with the name? <laughs> she, she was obviously lacking some inspiration that day for naming leaves kits. Leaves of grass. <laughs> Do you know what though? I know where she's coming from. Oh. So leave her alone. <laughs> <laughs> leave her alone. Leave, oh. leave, leave. That's a good joke, yes. Right, so, because you are going to be getting leaf-shaped beads in this kit, so there you go. Right, 
in this kit, what are you going to be getting? Here we go. So you're going to be getting beautiful uh, prey night faceted ovals. Oh, lovely, lovely, lovely. These are stunning gemstones, aren't they? Beautiful um, rutilated inclusions inside each one of these beautiful ovals. Proper black rutilated inclusions, which are just gorgeous, aren't they? Lovely, lovely faceting on these as well. Um, great size on these, they, they make great rings. They're that kind of size which would make a, a fantastic ring, but equally a great pendant. You could even put them in earrings to make a really big statement pair of earrings. Lovely, lovely prey night faceted um, um, ovals. What I love so much about this particular strand is of course the fact you've got lots and lots of inclusions, so you really get to see the characteristics on, and, and the characters, um, uh, the character of the gemstone, really, really beautiful. Uh, next gemstone strand, wow. Ooh, wow, this mm -hmm. is a long strand, goodness me. Oh. That's absolutely amazing. Now you're gonna be getting, I'm trying to look at this, the length of the strand here. Does it say the length of the strand? Mm. doesn't say does it because it's shell isn't it oh it's white agate oh I do beg your pardon oh I'm, I'm trying to look for the size of these gemstones and the and the length of the strand it doesn't actually say but look look at this white agate nuggets wow look at that I thought it was shell but 38 centimeters Wow, that is a long strand. And actually, it, it does look longer than that, doesn't it? Wow, that is a really, really long strand. Gorgeous, 150 carats. It is, it is white agate. That's amazing. Really, really fantastic kind of um, um, irregular nuggets here, which is, oh, yeah, just gorgeous. Stunning, stunning, stunning strand there. Um, and the third and final strand are leaf-shaped beads. That's why it's called leaves of grass. There you go. <laughs> Carved leaves of clear quartz. So here you go. You've got little leaf-shaped uh, beads here, uh, which have been carved. So you get that beautiful leaf detail. That's just stunning, isn't it? Gorgeous, gorgeous, genuine gemstones here. That's on it, though, with this kit. You're also going to be getting your uh, threading pack with monofilament beading thread and elastic in. Just gorgeous. You're also going to be getting your findings pack with 115 silver-plated copper findings, which just look absolutely stunning, don't they? There they all are. Silver-plated copper findings with head pins, uh, with uh, spacer beads, crimp beads, crimp beads, covers, earring findings, a meter of chain, extender chains, toggle clasps, connector clasps. And then 10 meters of 0.6 millimeter gauge chartreuse colored copper wire. Having that added extra bonus of chartreuse colored copper wire, 0.6 millimeters engaged and it's a 10 meter length. Having this as part of this kit really makes it go so much further. We're actually going to see a technique using this incredible wire. Now, great price on this kit. Really, really fantastic for this time of year. Really, really fantastic for spring and for summer. Your deal today is stunning. You should be paying 34 pounds 70 for this kit today. Do you want to see your amazing deal today? 21.95. Looks good, doesn't it? How about we go even lower? Ha! Yes, for everything here today, for all of the gemstones, for the wire, for the threading pack, for the 115 findings, £18.95p. That is way, 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 way too low. And when you see the jewelry that Deb has made using the gemstones and using all the qualities from this kit, oh my goodness me, it's stunning because the statement necklace that she has made using the wire and the gemstones, oh my goodness me. That is the kind of necklace I would sell for twice the amount uh, that this entire kit's going for today, but we'll have a look at it in just a couple of seconds. Now, Deb, what was this kit like to work with? What was the prey night? The prey night's a gorgeous strand, mm. isn't it? It is. It's, um, I love it because it's such a peaceful sort of colour. It is, isn't it? It's um, quite a calm colour. Mm. Um, but it was, it was really sort of spring-like and floral and mm. um, it was... the. All of the shapes mm -hmm. and the colours um, worked really nicely 
together. Yeah, they do. Maybe it's because you get those kind of colours together in nature. Um, yeah. For whatever reason, they do work together beautifully. Um, the use of the wire, the fact that you've got wire in this kit has just allowed you to make the most stunning pieces, hasn't it? Well, it, it carries the green through a bit further as mm. well. Mm. Um, so Love that, that that's really nice to be able to take the colour through the design. Mm. Isn't that stunning? This design is just so beautiful. But you've used wire again in this in this design over here. You've used yeah. a lot of the wire. Did you have much wire left over or did you use pretty much um, all of it? That's what I had left. So that's like you've got what, a couple of metres left? Yeah, probably. Yeah. Isn't that amazing? This piece here is just stunning. With loads and loads. Oh look, this is like a twisted It's How um, you that there? a gizmo. It's a uh, twisted wire mm. for four lengths of wire. Mm. Um, twisted together and then wound round a gizmo. Clever. So made a gizmo coil and then pulled it out. But I it's like really it. strong because it's got oh, the, it the wow. sort of core strength of all the twisted wires. Yes, of course. The kind of combined amount. Yeah. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at the pro look how beautiful that pro night works. I love the fact that there are silver plated copper findings with this. I think it really uh, makes this kit really yeah. bright, doesn't it? Yeah, it, it lifts it and it makes it um, it makes it feel a lot cleaner and fresher yeah and, definitely um it would work equally well though with um rose gold or yellow gold plate i think you'd have a different looking kit wouldn't well. you if you use yeah. rose gold or gold but i think i think i think the silver i think the silver for me is right it's really really yeah. right this bracelet is beautiful Deb. Well, I, it was going to be a bracelet but i i've made it an anklet, long enough actually. for an anklet yeah. yeah because this felt so fresh and summery that it felt it felt nice to actually think about your ankles. Yeah, that would make a really beautiful <laughs> anklet, wouldn't it? Yeah. I love and what you've done with the head pins. Again, that's got the earring findings um, oh. around the clasp. Oh, yeah, end. look. Um, that's, that's using those earring findings again. Clever, and threading clever, clever. the leaf. Um, the quartz actually fits on, so that they've got really decent sized holes that's good to know in those gems as that's well. good to know i love what you're doing with the head pins as well you've kind of rolled the head pins yeah. um to get the little stars um facing forward and backwards um on the on the bright on the um, anklet that's a really really lovely little design feature isn't it well they Gorgeous. catch the light as as you move they do in, don't they um which is really nice yeah, gorgeous. Now, what technique are you going to show us, Deb? Um, I was going to show just how I made the flowers. Oh, yes, please. Which are very simple. Mm. And um, also, with the wire, because it's 0.6, um, it wouldn't have been strong enough to support the, um, the stones for the leaves mm -hmm. um, just on its own. Well, it is just on its own, but without actually doing some twisting with it so mm -hmm. if I show you quickly what I did for the leaves yeah that'd be I'll lovely show you the um, show you the the flower so I just snip off sometimes I work I can work on the the um, reel but most times I, I don't so the the necklace is actually made in three mm -hmm. sections snipping off I don't know just right, 35 mm -hmm. centimeters something like that so the wire goes through twice, through the, the gemstone, which means um, you then get two pieces of wire. I like quite random shapes, so I don't want to completely follow the stone mm -hmm. um, all the way around, but I will on one side. So then bring in um, one of the tails over the other, are just wrapped around and that gives it added strength yeah nice for you then to be able to position your, your leaf yeah, where lovely. you want and it holds um, otherwise it's it's going to be a bit too flimsy mm -hmm. so that was how how i did the um the leaf mm -hmm. and then f just formed the tails into loops and swirls mm. that I then attach my flowers onto. Which is just gorgeous, yeah, lovely. Okay. So the flowers take in five of the, the featherweight head pins mm. and five of the gorgeous quartz. Oh yeah, they're lovely. They just fit through, mm -hmm. they're simply. Though I did find that um, with a couple of the stones, the head pins went too far in, mm. and the the ball sort of disappeared into the 
the top of the gemstone. Um, so just swap the stone over and it'll be yeah. fine. Yeah. Because these are the super, super they fine They are the pins. really fine ones, yeah. So I use these for the flowers, mm -hmm. but also I attach the white agate um, using the tiara twist with the tails. Ah, okay. I'll show you. Just oh, gorgeous. bring them down to the end mm -hmm. and hold them. And then you transfer to a pair of flat nose pliers. Right. Okay. So you can hold that really firm at the end. Yeah. And just twist. Oh wow, that's here. awesome. I love what you're doing. So then don't twist all the way down because you'll use these tails to attach mm -hmm. your agate. Open up on the front and then a couple of the petals, if you twist them together, they just um, take up any additional um, oh, any additional head bits pin of white, yeah. So that it forces the, the stone down to the the end. Mm hmm tightens up your petals and then through the um, center mm -hmm. we use one of the flower spacers right with one of the thicker head pins oh nice okay and that forms the center of the flower like that oh does that look great and just use one of the the featherweight head pins to wrap your flower around the center isn't that fantastic? So you're using the head pins as wire, as, as, wire. Kind of, as using them as, to anchor yep. the design as well. Yeah. So um, once you've got it all attached together, obviously mm -hmm. spend a bit of time getting the petals positioned. You can cut off your thicker head pin mm -hmm. and then roll it. So you just chop it about a centimetre and a half from the end. Use your round nose pliers. And we'll just roll your head pin down. Right. And you, your green coloured wire mm -hmm. can then pass through that loop you've made. Ah, okay. It's all going to fall apart now. But that'll pass through there so you can attach your flowers onto the leaves. Onto your, your leaves and your structure. Isn't that gorgeous? Um, so that's. That was how that was made. And then these tails that you've got left, mm. you can add on your white agate, fold them in half and just tiara twist the ends. So you've got them all attached in one piece. That's gorgeous. Really, really lovely technique. They're an interesting way of using the super fine head pins and not yeah. kind of cutting them off and discarding the, discarding the ends, but actually using them in the design to help strengthen it and, and anchor it to the main design. Isn't that gorgeous? This kit, eighteen ninety five for a kit with wiring. That is an absolute steal of a deal. Well done to everyone who's come through to get that. That's gorgeous. Thanks, Deb. How are you getting on with your challenge? Okay. Yes. Ooh. Ooh. In the middle of making a gorgeous dramatic piece there. <laughs> Stunning. <laughs> right. Right. I've got a Labrador deal. It's gonna go. You know the uh, you know the deal that we just bought you for the smoky quartz, the deal that we bought you for the uh, emeralds, the deal that we bought you for pretty much all of our um, incredible strands today, and how low they've gone, how amazing they've been. Mike's just said in my ear. Mike is directly said, "Oh, it's time for this." Mm -hmm. Yeah. An absolute oh! whoa! Wow! Whoosh. <laughs> Whoosh. 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 It's like a magic necklace. It's so magical. Oh, whoa! I was still doing my sound effects. Here we go. Sorry, Mike. Sorry, Mike. Boom! It's just, it's absolutely delicious, isn't it? It's delicious. Can I take these off the bus now? Yeah, here we go. So, um, three strands of Labradorite. Three strands of Labradorite. Numero uno. 
faceted barrels of labradorite. Looking good, baby. You're looking beautiful, baby. Here it is. Faceted barrels of gorgeous labradorite, yeah? Amazing. Nine by six millimeters in diameter. Great for earrings, bracelets. That beautiful bracelet that we just saw. Um, uh, sorry, the anklet that Deb made from the last kit worked really well with this labradorite, wouldn't it? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Labradorite barrels. Labradorite uh, mm, trapezoids. I've got people multi-buying already. We haven't even shown you the price yet. So beautiful trapezoids of labradorite with labradorescence. Oh, yeah. Natural member of the Feldspar family. Oh, it's just delicious, isn't it? It's absolutely gorgeous with that beautiful labradorescence all the way through it. And this strand. Oh, 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 mama. Oh, mama. Oh, my word. Oh, my word. Ooh! Oh, my goodness me. Oh, oh. Ooh! Look at this. Look at that one there. Oh, wow. That's it, mate. That is a genuine labradorescence. That is absolutely out of this world. I just, oh, I want this. I want it. 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 I want every. <gasps> Oh my goodness, look at this. Can you see? Hang on. Oh. Ooh, I've got the purple flashes on that. Yeah. Here. Say that again, Deb. Purple. I've got purple <gasps> flashes. On oh, look that at one. that one. Oh, oh my word. Right, okay. I work with gemstones every day of the week, um, and I am literally aghast. At every single example. Look, here's, a, look, here's another one. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, my word. Genuine beauty. Mother Nature at her very, very, oh, best. Oh, my word. Right, okay. Let's just get, let, let, let's, just, let's just cut to the chase. This strand of gems... This strand of gemstones on its own, £14.95p. This strand on its own, £14.95 on our website. This strand on its own, £14.95. I think that is absolutely criminal. That is a strand of pendants. That is a strand of soutache pendants, a strand of wire-wrapped pendants, a strand of cocktail rings. A oh, that, I, I just want to wake up and look at that every morning. The whole bundle. Twenty pounds, twenty smackaroonies. Mary from Yorkshire says, "Gobsmacked at the Schiller Carol. It's stunning. Great price for all those gemstones." Mary, you're not kidding. This single deal. has got, it's got to be one of the sick, oh, <laughs> single best dip. Look at this one. I cannot, I can't actually find words to describe how much labradorescence I'm seeing in this bundle. It is the most incredible bundle of labradorite. I, oh my goodness me. I'm in danger of saying something very rude just because you forget where you are. Whoa. You forget where you are. Whopper chica. Whopper. Look. This is Mother Nature. This is why I love my job. This. This is why I love my job. Every single one of these. <gasps> Oh, that that one there. That has got to be the winner for me. That's that's the that's the that's the kitty. That one there. That's a ring. That's my ring. That's mine. It's mine. 
<laughs> it's just it's absolutely delicious. Claire, you've worked with gemstones for many, many years. Have you ever seen Labrador like this? I think on every single stone. It's, yeah, it's on every single stone. Yeah. To get this amount. Even on the lighter ones. Look at this one. Oh. oh. When you were showing that last stone, I, I could see that one on the desk and it was brilliant turquoise yeah. flashing out. Absolutely incredible. Why are we seeing so much labradorescence from these gemstones? Okay, well, they are very, very big labradorites. The more labradorite you get, um, the more labradorescence you're going to see. Only if it's labradorite of this quality. If it was labradorite of a rubbish quality, you're not going to see any labradorescence, no matter how big the gemstones are. The gemstone could be as big as a house and you might not see any labradorescence at all. If the labradorescence is a top, top quality labradorite and the gemstone's big, you're going to see you're going to get more labradorescence because the gemstone is bigger so you're going to get to see more the surface area is greater there's more light that can get into the gemstone because the gemstone is physically bigger but you're only going to get this amount of labradorescence if the labradorite is fantastic quality which it is judy from norfolk oh, we, oh you joined us yesterday Libby. um hello all i don't think i'll be able to sell this on i will want to keep it for myself do you know what you're not going to keep it for yourself it, 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 it's all mine I would be prepared to part with enough money to buy the entire stock of this because I know that if I made jewellery, if I just had, if I just made jewellery from this bundle from now until eternity, I know that every single piece of jewellery would sell. Mm. And you know, we've only got a few people who have multi-bought this. Louise from Greater Manchester, Ruth from uh, Avon. Do you know what? You, I hate to say it, if you, I, I, I would multi-buy this. I would just, I would multi. You get another, you, you get your other two strands as well. Your trapezoids, your barrels. Three stra. Oh, gee whiz. If everyone checks out the baskets, it's gone. That is amazing. Pete's Moonstone. I didn't know we had that on today's show. <laughs> Woo! Is this Indian peach moonstone? Or is it Africa? No, 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 no. When was the last time you saw this? Peach moonstone. Norwegian Ooh. peach moonstone. There is a very famous gemstone uh, that comes from Norway um, called sunstone, which uh, the source of which is underneath a glacier. Sunstone is a member of the Felsbar family. Labradorite is a member of the Felsbar family. Moonstone is a member of the Felsbar family. What do they all have in common other than being from the same gemstone family? They all have optical properties. Peach moonstone. What's it going to give you? Can you see that white beaming glow from these gemstones? That, that is natural. That is something called Schiller. Again, you only get Schiller in moonstone of a certain quality. When you get peach moonstone, don't expect to see rainbow um, Schiller, which you get with rainbow moonstone but expect to see a peachy white glow. Now, I have got no idea how low this is gonna to go today. This has literally been brought down in the last half an hour by our um, head of channel, Paula, Paula Bennett, find her on Facebook. Um, this, um, this strand, this gemstone I should say, not this strand, this gemstone was one of the first gemstones I ever brought to you when I started the late show on uh, on uh, jewelry maker when the late show started okay so the late show started two years ago two years ago on jewelry maker might be a bit yeah might be a bit longer than that actually wow but when the late show started on jewelry maker um, i was one of the presenters on the late show and one of my one of the first gemstones i ever brought to you on the late show was peach moonstone 
and it was a last it was a last in stock game it was a last in stock game and the strand of peach moonstone I had was almost identical to this let's uh, what how, how big are these ones are these 10 or 12 I think possibly they could have been 12 mil peach moonstones we had about eight or nine left of that strand and that strand we brought to you for around about 24.95 it might have been it might have been low to, lower 20s than that but it was around about the 20 pound price point there were about eight left um, and we brought it to you and it went it was last in stock it was fast it was furious it was wonderful okay I would like to demonstrate today and do you know what I've got no idea how those are going to go so I might have really shot myself in the foot but I would like to demonstrate to you how great our buying power has improved over the last few years what do I mean by that because jewelry maker has gone from strength to strength to strength because of you and it is all because of you um, we are able to demand lower prices for gemstones cut better deals with gemstones get even better quality gemstones I really hope I haven't shot myself in the foot with this because I've got no idea how low this is going to go. Um, the strand of Moonstone that I bought to you on the Late Show, and I remember it because it was one of the first strands I bought you on the Late Show, and I, and I remember that shift. Um, it, was, it, was, it was absolutely awesome. We were all really nervous, but it worked, and there were loads of you there. Um, that strand was yours for around about the £20 price point. Um, I'm so confident that our buying power has increased over the last few months, sorry, over the last couple of years, that I reckon this is going to be lower than the £20 price point. If it is, brilliant. If it's not, then I'll look a bit stupid. But hey, I'm not stupid every day. Um, the deal for this strand today, I've got no idea how low it's going to go. Genuine peach moonstone. Do you want to see a price? Please, 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 please be under 20. <laughs> please be under 20. Please be under... <gasps> Eight ninety-five. Why am I welling up? I'm welling up. That's really weird. How strange is that? No, but it's true. Our, bu <laughs> our buying power has increased so much. Isn't that amazing? Oh, go jewellery maker buying team. That's amazing. Eight pounds ninety-five p. Most people are multi-buying. Do you know what? That is amazing. Um, let me give you a, a few of you a name check. Carol from Berkshire, you've come in to get two. Eleanor from London, you've come in to get two. Glenna from Worcestershire, uh, sorry, Glennis from Worcestershire, you've come in to get two. Marianne from Cleveland, you've come in to get three. Louise from the West Midlands, come in to get three. Sue from Devon's come in to get three. You, uh, Eulilla in Surrey's come in to get two. Jane from Durham's come in to get two. Your, your, your names are going off the screen. Oh my goodness me, this is absolutely amazing. Mary from uh, Yorkshire, uh, never known you speechless, Carol. Hello, well, well, there you go. There you go. <laughs> Mirabel, there you go. I'm genuine. I'm genuinely. I'm so proud of that price point. I'm so proud of that price point. Susan from Merseyside coming to get two. Pamela from Nottinghamshire is coming to get two. Uh, a caller from Kent's coming to get two. Pamela, from, uh, this is just. There is so, Jackie from the West Midlands is coming to get two. Pamela, you, this is amazing. Your names are going off the screen. Maybe you remember that strand of moonstone. And it was a beautiful strand of moonstone. Had, I reckon, the same shiller as this. Around about the same sizes, maybe slightly larger. 8 95 for peach moonstone. When was the last time you saw peach moonstone? On oh, no, jewelry maker. Sheila from Surrey's coming to get two. Judith from Berkshire's coming to get two. I've said your name already. Mary from Lancashire. This is just, this is absolutely incredible. I mean, Deb, you can see people's names on the mm. screen. You can see the phone lines lighting up. Why do you think so many people are coming in to get... Joanna from Somerset's coming to get four. Well done to you, my love. Why do you think so many people are coming through to get this strand? I think it's because the tone of it is perfect. It's, um, it's that perfect mid-tone. It's not too dark. It's not too light. The, um, it's very close to skin tone, isn't it? It is. Yeah, it is. So it's it's absolutely perfect for bridal. It's oh, definitely. perfect for the summer. Yeah. Um, all the nude tones that are, are sort of coming through. And, yeah. But the quality of that, it's got sparkle. <gasps> it's, look. Yeah, sorry, I haven't been moving crazy. it enough. <laughs> that's why you just have to look at it. Just the colour, the tone, the sparkle the shiller just everything about it they look like peach moons don't they they do hence the name moonstone yeah 
<laughs> but Ma they really are peach. Yeah, definitely sometimes, peach. Sometimes, yeah. sometimes you look at it and you think, oh, it's it's not really. It's more brown, it's or it's more, more cream, yeah. or it's more pink. Yeah. yeah. The colour of those is is insane. They're beautiful. Well, I have to say that if that isn't proof of how our buying power has massively increased over the last two years, I don't know what is. Paula Bennett mm. is in that office there. I wish I could get her attention. Here's Paula, <laughs> head of channel. She just bought this. She bought this out about half an hour ago. Oh no, she's gone. She's oh, gone. Oh no, she's coming down. Oh no, she's actually <laughs> gone. I meant to say, I meant to say, this is incredible. But I think she said downstairs. Yes, Paula, you don't have to come downstairs. I think oh, she's, she's coming. coming downstairs anyway. <laughs> she's coming downstairs anyway. Uh, but quite seriously, that is absolutely astonishing. Still to come. Still to come. Sapphire. This is one of the latest presenters picks we've ever done ever. It should have been bought to you about 45 minutes ago. Never mind. <laughs> it's absolutely astonishing. It's coming up in a minute. Um, Paula, come in, come in here, lovey. Paula, head of channel. Here we go. Paula Bennett, find her on Facebook. Paula, Peach Moonstone. <laughs> we've just, oh my goodness. This is how yummy it is. Look at the hundreds of people coming through on the phone line to this. It's oh, amazing. You're, you're loving it. Oh, it's gorgeous. Mine. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, love. You're happy with that? It's amazing. It's gorgeous. Oh, good. Good, good, good. She's lovely. We love her. Okay, I'll go buy some more, Yeah, go and get some more. <laughs> Notice how I didn't tell her the price. <laughs> no, seriously. I didn't tell her the price. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't go that low, did they? Let me look at the details. Right. <laughs> Where are we going? Wall of Fame. We'll see you there. Ooh. Hello. Uh, I've got number 138 here, which is beautiful. Sent in by Gillian from West Yorkshire. Hello to Wallet Jewelry Maker. This is my second attempt at the Wall of Fame. I purchased the perfect pearl, uh, per perfect purple amethyst and pearl kits, pu -pu 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 -pu, uh, with rose gold findings. Recently, uh, recently, and added used, and added and used. Oh, sorry, and used Linda's original design as a basis for the necklace, and then followed on with some matching earrings and a bracelet uh, of my own design. I hope you like them. Loving the show. Good luck to all the week. Uh, good luck to all this week's waffers. Gillian, your email is like an email of tongue twisters. Perfect purple <laughs> amethyst and pearl kit with rose gold. <laughs> Tell you what, there's too many P's there. Best of luck to you though. Uh, this is 140 and I couldn't work out what it was made of. You can spot the leather, mm. um, but there's also something else in there. It's from Wendy King in Mottram it says hi all please find attached lovely leather and organza ring and multi-wrap bracelet set bracelet can also be worn as a choker wow. and headband pretty funky and just in time for summer loving that's leather and organza yeah it's brilliant isn't it I love it that's yeah. awesome clever lady best of luck to you my love number 139 here Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Again, using some um, organza ribbon here. Uh, this is from uh, Alpa, who says, um, hello, jewelry maker. Hope you're well today. I'm Alpa from Leicester. Hi, Alpa. I started watching jewelry maker shows last December and they are addictive. Good. I enjoy watching them and learning new skills from the shows. All the presenters are very lovely uh, and the products are beautiful. I wanted to send in a picture of a necklace that I made from gemstones and scales uh, that I purchased from Jewelry Maker. With lots of love and hugs to all the JM crew members, uh, Mrs. Alpa Shah. That is absolutely gorgeous. Love those mm. greens, perfect for spring. That's really awesome. I love the use of the organza ribbon there as well. Stunning. Okay, this one is from um, Christina, who's in Salisbury. Dear JM, here is my entry for this week. A simple pair of earrings woven in antique bronze and four millimeter green agate rounds. Mm. Lovely. That's really gorgeous, neat. isn't it? Yeah. Beautiful earrings there. Yeah. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And a lovely, lovely wire wrap pendant here displayed beautifully. Uh, number 141, sent in by Emma in Cra uh, Cambridgeshire. Hello everyone, here's my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. It's a wire wrapped sodalite stone with not point, uh, sorry, with eight millimeter wire uh, from Jewelry Maker and 0.3 millimeter wire from my stash. 
I love the patterns in the stones and I think it's perfect for summer. And Debbie Bulford always says, blue and white don't go out of fashion. She's right. <laughs> uh, good luck to everyone in the draw. And that's Emma from Cambridge. That's absolutely gorgeous, Emma. And do you know what? You're right. Blue and white always, always, always are in fashion, especially in the summer. Gorgeous. Mm. Right. Don't go anywhere. Presenter's pick coming up um, with Sapphire. Another great blue gemstone. Don't go anywhere. It's coming up in just a couple of seconds. Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order for just 50p and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates for items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from the Genuine Gemstone Company. Before any of the gemstones that arrive here in Jaipur can leave Jaipur for the UK, they need to be tested. So all the genuine gemstone strands go from the vendor to an independent laboratory. They're then tested to prove that they are what they say they are. Now as you can see here, this shipment of emerald arrived this morning and it comes with this. This is really important. This shows that the emerald has been tested in random strands and can be proven to be genuine emerald. If this authenticity card doesn't arrive with the genuine gemstone, then the shipment won't go to the UK. Get involved with Jewellery Maker by sending the studio a message during our live hours. You can send a text to 60777 and start your message with JM Studio or, alternatively, go to our website and click on Watch the Live Show. Simply type your message into the box and press Send. Make sure you stay tuned in case your message is read out. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. This is what you think it is. Sapphire. Totally natural sapphire. On today's show, we have brought to you some of the best um, deals on gemstones um, that we possibly could have done. We, we really, really have. Whether it's that beautiful peach moonstone, whether it's that gorgeous labradorite bundle, whether it's... Um, Stunning ruby that we did yesterday, that, that really sticks in my mind as an incredible deal. Um, I'd like you to imagine for a moment that you're in a jeweler's and you're looking for a really special piece of jewellery, okay? Or you're at a craft fair, you're looking for a really special piece of jewellery. You want to get your uh, loved one a really precious genuine gemstone, one of the big four, either a ruby, emerald, sapphire, or a diamond. Um, and you see a beautiful blue pendant in front of you. And you pick it up and you're told by the jeweler it's sapphire. But it's not just any sapphire. The majority of sapphire that you get in the marketplace nowadays, of gem quality sapphire anyway, is going to be, is going to be treated to one extent or another. Um, it could be, it could be, it could be uh, heat treated, it can be diffused, it can be coated. Um, but generally speaking, a huge amount of sapphire, um, around about 95% of sapphire is going to be treated to one extent or another in the marketplace. Most of it is going to be heat treated. You're told by this jeweler it's not just any sapphire, this is natural sapphire. No treatment. This is the same colour that ca it, 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 it came out of the ground. It's absolutely natural. Can I ask where this sapphire is from, please, Lovie? Right. African 
Sapphire. Is it blue? Oh yes. Oh yes it is. And you, rightly or wrongly, you have a price point in your mind of how much you would like to pay for this sapphire pendant. It's set beautifully, it's set with some gorgeous silver wire on a gorgeous chain. And you tell the jeweler your budget. You say, right, I, I don't want to spend any more than 80 pounds for this pendant. And the jeweler says, well, do you know what? For 80 pounds, for 80 pounds, you can not only have a sapphire pendant, but I can also sell you the sapphire earrings to match. And you think, oh my goodness me, a set of sapphire jewelry, pendant and earring set for, for under 80 pounds. And it's genuine, it's natural sapphire. Now, I can't guarantee that the sapphire we're offering you today is going to be below that kind of price point because you're getting close to, well, you're getting two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16. You're getting about 18, 18 of these gemstones on this strand. So I can't guarantee that you're going to be able to get all these gemstones for under 80 pounds. But you know, it's sapphire at the end of the day. It's natural sapphire. It's pretty special stuff, isn't it? Or can I? From Jewelry Maker, you can get this entire strand. And you can get this entire strand today for under 20 pounds, 17 pounds, 95p for the entire strand. It is bonkers. I know it is absolutely incredible. Natural, genuine, blue African sapphire for under £20. You are going to not only be a jewellery maker who works with genuine gemstones, you are going to be a jewellery maker who works with one of the world's most coveted, one of the world's most sought after, most legendary genuine gemstones, sapphire. And it's not just any sapphire, this is natural, unheated sapphire for £17.95p. That is very, very special indeed, isn't it? Well done. So many of you have come through to get us on the web and on the phone lines. I'm really, really, really pleased that you've made this yours. Um, it's one thing being able to bring you beautiful sapphire strands of gems of distinction strands, which have been individually hand faceted, and the clarity is great, the colour is great, they've been heat treated. Um, it's quite something else to be able to bring you one. 100 carats of natural untreated sapphire for under 20 pounds. That is something. It's amazing, isn't it? It's just incredible. Today, it's yours. Today, get it, have it, add it to your order. You've got a 30 day money back guarantee. If you do commissions and you start to, be, you know, you start to offer people, you start to offer people the opportunity to make them pieces of jewelry, but out of gemstones like natural sapphire, Goodness me, word, word is going to spread about, 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 about just what kind of a jewelry maker you are. Amazing, isn't it? Now, we've bought you Labradorite today, yeah? Great member of the, of the Felsbar family. We've bought you White Moonstone, fantastic member of the Felsbar family. We've bought you Peach Moonstone. That went down to a ridiculous price on, didn't it? Don't expect to ever see that again. Um, how about we bring you another member of the Felsbar family? I mentioned this a little bit earlier on. Sunstone. We tend to get our sunstone from one of two places, either Norway or uh, Africa. Um, these are faceted pear drops of sunstone. Now, the great thing, the great thing about this strand, and I wouldn't normally, I wouldn't normally concentrate on this when I bring you a strand, especially of sunstone, because it's such an interesting gemstone. There's so many wonderful features um, surrounding this gem. Is this, is this, is this Norwegian or African um, sunstone? Oh, it's Indian sunstone. Goodness me, I was going to say, you bet your bottom dollar is from a completely random place that uh, that I haven't mentioned. It's actually Indian sunstone. Well, that taught me. Um, the the most 
wonderful thing about this strand. Yeah, the colour is fantastic. The optical property is wonderful. You can see that kind of glittery sparkliness inside the gemstone. That's natural, by the way. Um, that kind of silver shiller, which is why a lot of people do mix this up with, uh, with moonstone. Um, it, is, it is very, very different, though. You've got a, a, a better clarity, more of a suspended sparkle inside this gemstone rather than a, a kind of like a layered shiller, which you get with uh, your peach moonstone. The best thing about this strand for me is the fact that these pear drops aren't drilled through the top, they're drilled from top to bottom. Why? Why does that make this strand even more fantastic? Okay, if I just do that, thread a head pin through one of these, a pendant, thread a head pin through two of these, a pair of earrings. More often than not, with these kind of faceted drops that we get um, in, they're drilled through the top of the tapered part of the gemstone. So they make fantastic earrings, fantastic chandelier style earrings. But, but really, if you want to get that really, really um, secure setting, popping a head pin through, directly through the gemstone is fantastic. And having these drilled from top to bottom is actually very, very tricky. But I think it really, really suits a strand like this. Now, the price point for this strand is absolutely, it, it's verging on the ridiculous. We've shown you some ridiculous price points today. Do you remember that Moonstone that we took down to, what was our price on the Moonstone? Was it 895? 895, well that was just ridiculous, wasn't it? Surely we're not gonna go anywhere near that kind of price point with this strand. Apparently this should be 995. Do you think that's gonna be the price? No, nah. no. Nah. Last in stock, less than 70 chances available. This is your deal. Oh, look at that gorgeous shiller. Seven pounds ninety-five p. Do you know what? We may as well just we may as well just go the whole hog. Seven ninety-five today for genuine sunstone. What a price point to go with the peachy coloured moonstone. Yep, one hundred percent to go with the gorge, uh, which is sold out by the way. To go with the beautiful coated smoky quartz that we bought you today. How much was that again? That was seven ninety-five, wasn't it? Seven ninety-five. Fantastic. Just go for it to go with any one of our Labradorite or Moonstone bundles today, absolutely 100%. Yeah, just go for it. 60 carats of genuine Sunstone with a load of Schiller, natural, natural, natural Schiller going through it for under eight pounds. Just gorgeous. Stunning, stunning, stunning strand there. Well done. Lots of you coming through for this. And again, if you do want to multi-buy then please do go for it. And um, there's about a 30 second queue on the phones at the minute, so just be uh, patient. We'll answer your call as soon as we can. Isn't that great? Fantastic strand there of beautiful, gorgeous, peachy coloured um, sunstone there. Well done. Right, which one? Oh, yeah. So we bought your smoky quartz earlier on. Oh, it's alive. Smoky quartz, coated smoky quartz nuggets. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Gorgeous, gorgeous clarity, beautiful coated quality on your um, strand of smoky quartz here. Silver with gold. It's really amazing. And um, um, Deb said a little bit earlier on this would go so well with Labradorite. And do you know what it would do? Against Labradorite, that's going to look amazing. But against any kind of metallic gem, it's going to look wonderful as well. I mean, smoky quartz goes with absolutely everything. But once it's got a coating on it, do you know what? It, 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 it's kind of, it, it, it's more suited to your gemstones like um uh, hematite and pyrite and labradorite it, it, it looks so fantastic doesn't it it's almost like a blue blue smoky coating and as deb said it, it makes the smoky quartz look even more smoky it really does doesn't it? it's beautiful we bought this to you earlier on the price point was absolutely ridiculous because it goes so well with the sunstone and the moonstone that we just bought you do you want to see a price we're just going to recap it 7.95 there you go brilliant isn't it fantastic recap for your beautiful smoky quartz and you're getting roughly 10 gemstones on in the, on, on this strand I, I would make just 10 statement rings out of these wouldn't you 10 rings out of these sorry kim how would you use this ah i like that idea yeah how about using these with some gold plated copper findings wouldn't it be lovely if we had some of those on the show today what we do we've only got a few of these left Two thousand four hundred findings. Yeah, I know. Two thousand four hundred findings. That sounds like a lot. It is an awful lot, but you're going to use these. Two hundred of these yellow gold plated copper jump rings. Five mil open jump rings. Two hundred of those. Eight of these, which are your yellow gold plated copper extender chain ribbon ends with S clasps. 
a slap seven. Nine of those. Oh, no, sorry, eight of those. I beg your pardon. Uh, 30 of these. I can't believe you've got 30 in this pack. 30 T-bar toggle clasps. How amazing is that? Yellow gold plated copper. 30 of those. 30 pairs. So 60 in total. 30 pairs of these earring findings. Yellow gold plated copper earring findings. Shepherdsick earring findings. Three metres, well, actually more than three metres, and, and Deb, myself, and Claire kind of stretched these out. Basically, oh, hang on, that one's got a knot in it now because I've been jangling it around. Three, three times that of chain. That is just neck, that, that is ridiculous. Three lots of that. So that's about six foot of chain. No, six foot, uh, six, no. Yes, two, four, six, no, three, six, nine. Six, nine, yeah. nine feet, nine feet of chain. So I'm just randomly saying numbers. Nine feet of chain. And then 2,100 spacer beads. This is quite incredible. 2,100 of these yellow gold plated copper spacer beads. There is so much in this findings pack. Absolutely incredible. 2,400 findings in total. Your price point for all of this is just absolutely sensational. 39.95. Now, Gemma Crow was on the show the other week. She bought a pack of, now Kim, can you remember what she bought a pack of? Yeah, she bought a pack, not, not from Jewelry Maker, but she bought a pack of spacer beads. Um, were they yellow gold or were they yellow gold? Are they yellow gold plated copper? I can't remember if she said, that. oh, definitely copper. So definitely um, either yellow gold plated copper or just copper spacer beads. You put, uh, paid four ninety five for a pack of one hundred. That if you if you kind of transfer that to this pack of two thousand one hundred findings, that would be over a hundred pounds, about one hundred and four pounds just for this pack of two thousand one hundred spacer beads. Not to mention which, not to mention the fact you're going to be getting about well you're going to be getting three meters of chain, so much chain, 30 pairs of earring findings, 30 pairs of earring findings, 30 toggle clasps, eight extender chains with ribbon ends and S, and S, club, uh, S clasps, and 200 jump rings. So if you kind of add all of that onto the 104 pounds um, equivalent, then that is absolutely ridiculous, isn't it? 39.95 for 2,400 findings. Yellow gold plated copper findings. That is absolutely amazing, 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 amazing. Stunning, well done. So under 40 pounds there, tremendous deal. Woo, woo! Still got more of you coming through for that, which is great. And they come in these little boxes, which are really cute. Keep them all separate. Keep them all separate, keep them all separate, keep them all separate. Yeah, yeah. Right, so the comb. Yes, the comb deal. Where is my... Bring me my bow of burning fire. Da, 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 da. This bundle is going to enable you to make pieces of jewellery like these. Beautiful hair combs, multi-gem hair combs. This, um, this has been made using a hair comb. How cool is that? Rosanna, who's one of our budding beaders, has made uh, both these beautiful pieces. She's made them using gemstones and hair combs. Now, gemstones and hair combs. That rhymes. Um, Deluxe gem selection. Here it is. Check this out. I love doing this. I bet it really annoys Amelia, but I really like it. Oh, yeah. Look at that great heap of gemstones there. Nom, 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 nom. Nom, 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 Oh, I heart gemstones. Um, you are going to be getting uh, 350 carats of semi-precious gemstones here, including there's some labradorite, there's some amethyst, smoky quartz, moonstone, garnet, um, carnelian, there's some citrine, some quartz, some topaz in there. Loads and loads of gemstones in there. Okay, so... Um, this deluxe gem sex, uh, deluxe gem section, deluxe gem selection, ha! Deluxe gem selection on its own is twelve ninety five. 
the price for the entire bundle today. Yeah. That's like going into a shop, buying your deluxe gem selection. <coughs> Excuse me, for twelve ninety five, taking it to the till. Someone's saying, oh, do you know what you get a freebie with that? They get, I don't want a free sticker. I don't want a free bag, like a free carrier bag. I don't want a free stamp, you know, like a, 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 a free bit of paper. I don't want a free flyer. I don't want a, I don't want any of that business. No, no, no. You get 10 free hair combs. What? So hang on, 12 95 for the, for the deluxe gem selection. Then I get my 10 hair combs for free. Oh yeah. For absolutely free, 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 as in nothing, as in you pay nothing other than the 12 95 for the deluxe gem selection. That is incredible. That's a true freebie. Susan says, great show. Love the deals. My husband says he will be a pauper and will have to work just for my habit. Long may it continue. Love it all. Susan. Susan, do you know what? Good for you. Ah, good for you. There are worse habits, aren't there, love it? Yeah. Tell your husband, we're only live for another eight minutes. Then there's a designer inspiration show. You've got to tune in for that as well. But yeah. But quite so, well, yeah, and the late show as well. Actually, just, just, just don't tell your husband anything. Just keep on buying. I would. There are worse habits, aren't there? There are. Yeah. Much worse. Yeah. 12 95 for the deluxe gem selection. The combs, the 10 combs, 10 silver coloured hair combs are free. Absolutely free. And they're not shoddy um, um, uh, uh, quality. These are absolutely 100% great, great, great quality. Look at that. Really fantastic quality. They're not plasticky. They're not going to break. They're really, really fantastic quality. 10 free hair combs. Just awesome. Right. Deb, I'm coming over. Woo. We're going to have a look at your challenge kit. Have a look at your challenge. Have you enjoyed it? I've loved it. Have yeah. you? What have you loved about it? Oh, the colours, the shapes. It's it's gorgeous. The shapes really in this nice. kit are just I like the shapes. absolutely gorgeous, aren't they? And those flowers are, are mega. Oh, you like the flowers? I do. Like the flowers, you do. Like yeah. the flowers, yes. I'm in the middle of watching the uh, Star Wars trilogy at the minute. My husband's never watched Star <laughs> Wars. Ever. <gasps> Ever. No. It's weird, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, we watched uh, A New Hope. Empire Strikes Back. We got to watch Return of the Jedi tonight. I can't wait. It's my favourite one. <laughs> Boom! Can't wait. They don't watch the, new, the newer ones. So. You're sorry? They don't be watching the newer ones. They're rubbish. Oh, the new ones are rubbish. No, no, no. I haven't watched the new ones. No, no. They're absolutely rubbish. They're awful. With that Jar Jar Binks or whatever. Yeah. He's really, really. Oh, Stupid no. thing. Don't watch that. I've seen, you know, the, the pod racer. Oh, the pod racer that Anakin races. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I've seen it. This, this far away from it, the real thing. That's quite cool. I like mm. that. Yeah, That's quite cool. Went I like to that. Milan and there was an exhibition. Star there Wars you go. Exhibition. There you go. It's not as cool as your jewelry, though. <laughs> the jewelry you've made is absolutely gorgeous. How have you done this in the time we've given you? That's amazing. Check, check, check it out. Beautiful. Look at that vine asymmetric necklace, Deb. That is beautiful. I bet you really enjoyed making that one, didn't you? I loved you? it. Yeah. I it's loved it. stunning. And just use the, the knotted strand as the basis. Oh, so you so haven't actually built. taken it off the strand. Ah, no. clever. So I built it on the strand. That's awesome, isn't it? Isn't that clever? Deb's a clever, clever <laughs> lady. Um, everything Deb has made um, in this necklace has been made Ooh. using the kit, which is a challenge kit that we gave to her, um, incorporating this gorgeous knotted strand of graduated black agate which she hasn't actually taken the central gemstones off the strand, she's actually left them on the temporary beading strand, which is brilliant, because they're all knotted in between. The quality's really amazing anyway. We may as well leave it on there. A double strand of eyelight. These amazing carved obsidian leaves. Can I show you the detail on these? Look at that, look at that. Isn't that amazing? That kind of carved detail. Can you see that? carved leaf detail on your obsidian leaves and then these beautiful flowers of clear quartz and they are stunning you really enjoyed using these didn't you Deb? Mm, I loved it. What do I you really think so much about it. the flowers? Um, well I like the flowers because they're five petal flowers mm. and I'm okay. a bit I'm a bit funny about my flowers they've got to have five or seven or We've got to odd have odd numbers. numbers. Um, so they are absolutely perfect and the clarity on them is amazing every single one mm. You know, Every single one's beautiful, isn't they're, it? They're just all amazing, the whole strand. Yeah. Um, 
and they're a really nice size mm. as well mm. so you can make some really delicate things with it yeah you can do it's it, it's such a gorgeous selection of gemstones and not to mention which you've also got your threading pack 115 silver plated copper findings and 20 meters of 0.8 millimeter gauge silver colored copper wire what should be costing you 49 pounds and 10p actually today was 24.95 for everything you can see there that is just incredible that is such an awesome 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 price mm -hmm. um i love this necklace that you've made here as well and and everything that um that um that deborah's made here is only using what she was given as part of this challenge so it's only from this kit yeah. look at that oh i love that tassel <gasps> Oh, that's beautiful. I, I'm See what still adding flowers. on, so I'm adding more into that as well. Mm. But it's um, I love the, the noise. noise. The gems. Yeah. <laughs> well, it is, isn't it? Jewelry yeah. isn't just about the yeah. way that it looks or the way that it feels. It's about the way that it sounds. It, it sounds beautiful. This piece of jewelry is really sensory. It's gorgeous. Loads of you putting this in your basket now. And um, quite often it can take, it can take, you know, you see the kit at the beginning of the show and think, yeah, do you know what? I like that. I like that. And some of you will come in and get it. Some of you won't come in and get it. You say, oh, well, I just want to wait and see what kind of jewelry Deb makes. Loads of you are adding this to your order now because the jewelry is just so striking and so dramatic, isn't it? Beautiful little earrings as well. See what you mean about those flowers. They're gorgeous, mm. Deb. Yeah. They're really, really beautiful. Um, the Sorry, I was just no, going to no, say no, the, 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 the gems on there are just the ones off the end of the um, the strand. Oh, okay. So, so there's some of the some smaller, smaller gemstones. Yeah. Isn't that lovely? lovely lovely earrings now if you want to carry on watching jewelry making you can do because it doesn't end here uh, make sure that you uh, go to our website if you uh, haven't got if if you can't uh, watch uh, the designer inspiration show on your tv go to our website which is jewelrymaker.com to continue watching um, we've also got the late show tonight um which is absolutely fantastic it, it's like a miss it miss out show it's just wonderful and um, we've got with us today we've got lovely jenny cleary who's our guest designer today oh it's sammy Hi. sammy's with us today and lovely uh, jenny cleary who's just bonkers and we love her uh, <laughs> So both those lovely ladies with us today. Um, I'm not in tomorrow, but I'm in on Saturday. Well, on Saturday, I can't remember who we've got in on the show. I wish I could remember, but it doesn't matter. But I'm in on Saturday. When are you next in, Deb? Sunday. Sunday, of course, mm -hmm. for the birthday show. Yeah. Birthday show on Sunday, which is going to be absolutely <laughs> tremendous. Um, we've got one of the best DVD offers we have ever, 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 ever bought you. Um, so that's going to be absolutely wonderful as well. Thank you very much for joining us today. If there's anything you want to add to your order, anything from the early birds, um, to this challenge pack to absolutely anything um, um, uh, that we brought to you on today's show please do add it to your order thank you very much for your text as well you you lot have got some weird <laughs> food idea. combinations out there you really do i think probably the weirdest one was the christmas pudding and bacon and egg mm. one that was that wins that was odd that was very very odd indeed I don't feel <laughs> I, don't, I don't feel quite so strange now liking peanut butter and marmite and bananas see i don't like peanut butter what? And I don't like Christmas I no pudding. longer want to talk to you. It's one of my absolute favourite foods. I could eat no. it by the jar. I love it. Yeah, my husband does. Tons of peanut love butter. Love it. Absolutely love peanut butter. Anyway, what do you like? No. Right. Um, <laughs> Please tune in for our designer, uh, a designer inspiration show. It's going to be absolutely fantastic with Jenny and with Sammy. Um, loads and loads of wire work, loads of tools I can see over there mm. as well. So make sure you tune in um, either on our website or stay tuned on our uh, on our channel now. Thanks a lot, Deb. It's been great to have you Thanks, with us today. Carol. Take care, guys. See you in a bit. Bye. Bye. This Sunday, join us on Jewelry Maker as we celebrate our fourth birthday.